Is your system struggling to keep up? Experience the comfort of Yates Maintenance Heating and Air. It is our mission to provide world-class service and HVAC solutions backed by our certified indoor air quality expertise. Visit YatesMaintenance.com to find out more. You want an education that's going to take you places. To know that your instructors are going to support you when the work gets hard and cheer you on when you succeed. You want programs that fit with your busy life, challenge you, and put you on the path to the career you've always wanted. And you want to stay out of debt. At UAHT, you can. Is your system struggling to keep up? Experience the comfort of Yates Maintenance Heating and Air. It is our mission to provide world-class service and HVAC solutions backed by our certified indoor air quality expertise. Visit YatesMaintenance.com to find out more. You want an education that's going to take you places. To know that your instructors are going to support you when the work gets hard and cheer you on when you succeed. You want programs that fit with your busy life, challenge you, and put you on the path to the career you've always wanted. And you want to stay out of debt. At UAHT, you can. You don't want your education to be on hold. You want an education in HVAC that prepares you for good jobs right now. Where your instructors teach you the skills you need to be competitive. You want to be prepared to enter the workforce immediately. And you want to stay out of debt. At UAHT, you can. Is your system struggling to keep up? Experience the comfort of Yates Maintenance Heating and Air. It is our mission to provide world-class service and HVAC solutions backed by our certified indoor air quality expertise. Visit YatesMaintenance.com to find out more. You want an education that's going to take you places. To know that your instructors are going to support you when the work gets hard and cheer you on when you succeed. You want programs that fit with your busy life, challenge you, and put you on the path to the career you've always wanted. And you want to stay out of debt. At UAHT, you can.
Is your system struggling to keep up? Experience the comfort of Yates Maintenance Heating and Air. It is our mission to provide world-class service and HVAC solutions backed by our certified indoor air quality expertise. Visit YatesMaintenance.com to find out more. All right, welcome back. Getting ready for the start of the junior boys game. We got Akern a a here tonight. That's the way Phillip says it, I think. We got a new system going tonight, so y'all should be able to see uh, the, the clock and everything. I just got told not to bump the table. Yep, don't bump the table. Akern is going to win the win the tip. Um, win, Wilson's up top. Levi, Caleb almost with the steal right there. Parker is also a starter, and so is Reed. Caleb's going to track that one down. Akron's kind of like us, Philip. They they look uh they're, they're smaller. They ain't got the size for sure. My voice is about half gone. I'm sorry. About half gone. Well, I have not recovered from the 21 basketball second grade game. games the other day that I hollered at the whole time. What'd you holler the whole time? Dribble, dribble, dribble. Levi dribbles in and pulls in. He gets the two to go. Win. We're gonna put a little, little, little pressure on here. Uh, Parker, Parker, it away. Up, Parker. Yeah, he's got to get rid of that as soon as he he steals it. It's going to be a turnover. Spring Hill's ball. I left all my rosters at the house, Philip. So. Ooh. That's kind of a. That's okay. That's okay. Funny, put, funny put place to catch it. Levi kicks it to Parker. Dribbling pulls up. He misses that one. Akron's out trying to push. Levi with the rebound, gets it out to Reed. I seen our new uh, football eleven man conference. Yeah, Ooh, yeah, that's yeah. got to be wet right there. He yeah. didn't slip. Reed took a pretty good spill. Caleb with the rebound. And he's going to try to get it, get it up the floor a little bit quicker. Oh, he had Levi for just a second. Dumps it to Parker. Parker with a spin move. And that's a good move right there. Akron's going to take a timeout. Sorry, I'm on my phone trying to trying to get it to where, where my screen won't lock so I'll be able to have a roster. I'm trying to save my voice. Well, she sent me the, the senior boys roster, so I'm going to have to text this and send me the senior boys. We know most of them. I know most of them. Parker, Taylor, Reed, Levi. Yeah, and I, I know some of the bench. Um, There's a few new kids that, I, that I'm not real sure about. Phillips. Phillips was his first name. Dr is it Drake? Drake Phillips. I think that's right. Is it? 
See, that's the, that's the thing. I don't, I don't, I can't remember. Mm-hmm. I know his last name is Phillips. UAHT graduates from Spring Hill High School can attend UAHT for free their first year with a Hempstead Guarantee Scholarship. You visit uaht.edu slash Hempstead Guarantee to learn more. All right. Levi and Reed up top with the pressure. Akron does a pretty good job of breaking it. Pretty good defense. He just got it on rebound. And yeah, like, I, yeah. I mean, just the hand come down. Yep. I wasn't real sure who we were playing. I said Washita River School, School District. School District. Yeah, so I'm guessing Akron. I don't know who they would have consolidated with. Uh, Parker looks like he may have twisted his ankle, so Aiden's going to check in. I don't know who, who that Washita is. that going to be? Um, I don't know. If it's got to be like a Bradley Emerson Taylor deal. Yeah, it has to be. Caleb gets that rebound off the miss free throw. Akron's in the two three defense. Oh, good oh, pass! Good, job. good pass from Caleb there. Levi just kind of snatched that one out of the air. That's a good that's a good press break right there from Akron. Number four is is a is a small kid, but he, he just pulled that he'll, one. He'll, that's the second one he's tried. He may be a seventh grader, Philip. Might be. Wind drives in, can't get it to go. Akron comes out and he's running. Levi was some pretty good defense right there. There's not a whole lot else that he could have done. Reed's going to get called for the travel. Yeah, for, for right now, it looks like Spring Hill is going to go back to the 11, man. Um, yeah. Unless know. something something drastic happens and they and they change it. Um, well, I was uh, looking on there, too. Like, Genoa was eight-man last year. They're going back. They're 4A. Four 4A. Four yeah. yeah. That's, they have a huge they're enrollment. With, they're in there with Malvern and Nashville. Yeah. Yeah. They could, that's, that's a tough conference right there. Aiden in there fighting for the rebound, and he knocks it away, and Caleb ends up with it. Win in the corner, kicks it down to Aiden. Aiden dribble, and he flips it up a little short. Reed's fighting for it, and he's going to get fouled. Give me a water. Give me a water. Oh, that's a good seal right there by Aiden. Wind's going to get it. Still it off its foot. Yep. Akron ends up being able to save it. Uh, that's a foul by Wynn. Oh, that's a little give and go action. Aiden with the defense. Akron loses it off of uh, off of his leg. That's the give and go, Philip. We ran that in Pee Wee. Me and Cody did that. That's, that was our go-to play. Akron's going to extend out a little bit. I take steal the ball and run. Pretty good ball movement. Let's go, shot Levi. All right, uh, Caleb with the with the tip there. A little tip action. Get over now. Get over now. Get over now. Don't touch it, Aiden. Pretty good. Pretty good pressure from the from the defense right there. Oh, here comes Megan Fisher. I wonder if she'll get thrown out tonight. Last time she was here, I think she got thrown out. I don't think she's here the other night. Akron's going to put a little pressure on now. That's a good break. Break. Right, Wynn's so got to keep going. Right there at the free throw line, Wynn. Reed pulls the three. No, he gets it to go. Still in the press. Trying to get the trap. Reed, Reed might have got away with one. Uh, Caleb tipped it, but it just didn't have enough on it. Under a minute now. That's a dangerous pass to throw that. 
that high lob is just man, it's just it could get st- it could get stole real easy. Wynn's gonna get it. He's gonna drive. And Akron's gonna get a charge. He looked a little confused. He wasn't sure exactly which one he wanted to call there, I don't think. Because Wynn's went it, it probably was a charge. But I don't know if that dude was set or not. I wasn't really close to looking that close. Theoretically, you don't have to be set to take a charge. You just got well, to be yeah, in you have to be in the legal guard position. position. Wynn tips that one. Ooh. Ooh. Caleb with defense. Reed's fighting for it. It's going to be Akron's ball on the baseline. Some, I heard I heard somebody in the crowd go, go white, and they went, boom. Like, Caleb with the rebound. You got to watch the clock here. You're not in a hurry. Good pass from Levi. Wynn Here's has it. Aiden with the hook. Couldn't get it to go. Six seconds now. Wynn's going to get a block to end the first quarter. I almost said half. Caney Creek Estates, a family-friendly a family friendly community and affordable living. Diamond Bank, the natural choice for community banking. Yates Maintenance, heat and air experts for your home or business. Make sure you're, uh, if you're on Facebook watching, make sure you're uh, following our YouTube uh swark dot today make sure you subscribe to their youtube channel um we appreciate appreciate that and we appreciate you sharing it if you're on facebook as well i think the Aiken girls are supposed to be pretty good well our girls seem to be on a little bit of a roll right now philip they are uh they've won some ball games uh some close ball games i think foreman the other night was was a pretty tight pretty tight game the one before that was also a pretty tight game the boys game was not tight. No, the boys the boys have, have won a couple um by some pretty good margins. I think the was it the Murfreesboro game the girls also won by by a thin margin and the boys boys had had a little more difficult time. Um but but the girls are seem to starting to figure it out a little bit. Hey, winning close ball games is going to be a going to be huge moving down the um Um, can't hear or uh, uh, can't. Uh, it's going to be good for them whenever they do get get in a, a tight game and in some conference play. Wynn's going to have it down low. That's a foul. I mean, geez, a mighty jump ball. So it's going to go to Akron. I'd like to see a little bit of a reach there, maybe before the foul. It before is before the jump. Drake Phillips has checked in the game. That's that is who who that one is, Phillips. Reed's going to get called for one. Hand check. Win with the pressure. Now Caleb Trapp. Good still. Yep. Right, right. Yeah, he just stepped out of bounds. But you like to... You like the aggressiveness there. He's he's cutting, it, cutting in front of it, yeah. Who? Yeah, yeah. I put two on him. Oh, win has got to be ready for that one. 22 from the free throw line. Drake's going to get called for the foul. All right, call on Caleb. Is it, he did call it on Caleb. That's two on Caleb. Lucas is going to the scorer's table. Probably going to get Caleb. Uh, they missed the first one. Parker, go down. Parker, go down. Okay, Parker, stay up. Parker, stay up. Have you seen that? I, I, I may have said it the other night. Have you seen the thing where they cross instead of just trying to block out? Yeah. That's, over, that's the over the back. 
22 is going to get called for the foul. That was a cheap one. It was a cheap one. They get set up to press, though. They do. Wind needs to be going. Middle. There it is. Drive. Parker, drive. That's a block. That's a block. Oh. He he wasn't sure. He wasn't sure. He just knew it had to be one of the two. He got a 50-50 shot. That he got it wrong. Yeah. I mean, as a matter of fact, I mean, he was falling before he got hit. Because I guess I'd probably be falling before I got hit, too. Well, I wouldn't, wanna get, yeah, I wouldn't want to get hit either. I mean, Parker's a big ninth grader. He is a big ninth grader. Drake in there fighting for it. <laughs> Parker's going to get called for another one. Aiden's going to go to the scores table. That's, that's two quick ones. That's... That wasn't a. I don't think that was a foul either, Philip. He looked like he had his hand straight up. Now I can't. I couldn't see from from the angle that I'm sitting at, but it, he could have hit him with his body. That that would have been the only thing that. I don't know. That would have probably been near as bad as the charge on this end. That was tough. Missed it. Aiden tips it, gets it to Win. Win almost had it stole from the back, and Win just turns and luckily, That's Lucas hard. was there. They're starting to call a lot of fouls now. Yeah. They are starting to pile up. Spring Hill's got four. I mean, we're uh, understanding. We're a minute into the ga- or into this quarter. Yeah. Greed catching shoot. That was a foul. Yeah. Wind's going to be up top. I'd like to see Wynn try to like stay on his feet a little bit more. Don't jump at it. Drake's going to steal it, and he's out running. Got to watch behind him. And it's going to get lost. Akron's going to get called for a travel, though. Who's going to score? Drake just needs to spin in right there. Reed catch and shoot off the inbounds, and he's going to go to free throw line. Well, that's too. probably who it's going to have to go to. You got Levi on the bench, Caleb on the bench, and Levi uh, and Parker on the bench. Yeah, Reed Reed can score. Uh, Reed just he's, made he's a more three. of a point guard, but I mean, he has made a three so far. Like I said, but I mean, like I said, you just can't you can't be Arkansas and go through a a, a big drought. drought. Yeah. Reed got that one to go. Yeah, the you can't go through a scoring drought. Lucas and Drake up top on this press. I mean, you can go through one, but it can't be a six-minute one. And especially if you if you're gonna let them score. Pass is gonna be deflected, and Drake's gonna get get there, and it's gonna tie it up. So it's gonna be Spring Hill's ball. Lucas is going to have it up top. It's going to be – they're going to say it ain't. I thought it might have got deflected. I didn't think it was either. Levi's going to check back in. Does Levi just have – Levi on – I don't think he's got – He I don't think he's in foul trouble. <laughs> that top guy on the one three one has got to work. Levi's gonna gonna get a pass and he's gonna steal it. And a foul. That's a cheap foul. You can't I mean, I un- understand what he's trying to do, just trying to trying to trying to draw his concentration, but if you reach over there and you actually you actually touch him, they're, they're gonna call that. And the twenty two's got three, and he's one of their uh guys that breaks the press with it with his Size. He's the, he's one of their only ones with size. Yeah, Levi misses it. Go back up, it. You got to shoot the ball. Reed drives. That's a nice take from Reed right there. 
Lucas and wins up top. Ooh. Ooh. Yeah. It, it, it kind of looked like a travel to me, too. You can move. You can move. That's that's one thing that we don't – I don't think it's taken advantage basket. of. Yes. Yeah, if after, after made baskets, basket. you can move on that baseline down there. You know, here's the deal. I don't ever remember a coach telling me that. We had like, some plays that, that was designed to do some now stuff. That we would have some plays that like if on a press. That, yeah. But I don't remember the coach ever saying, like, any time they make a basket, you can run the end line. I always would ask the official, hey, can I run it? Or yeah. can I move? But it's after any made basket you, you can move. Hafford Medical Services, let us take care of everything. Brazil Oak Crest Funeral, the funeral home, we care. Heather Manor Nursing and Rehabilitation, providing your loved ones with the care they deserve. We appreciate all of our sponsors. And I, I know y'all can see them behind the home bench is the, uh, is the seniors' portraits up. And we only got two seniors that are girls this year. But there is a whole ton of or five, nine senior boys this year. So there's a bunch of them. Levi's going to get it. Gets it down to Aiden. Aiden's going to dribble, and he gets two to go. It's a good pass from Levi and a good finish from Aiden. Reed stopped the ball. Matt called that one. He did. There's a – Wynn's going to get it. Look at, Aiden, gonna, look at Aiden, look at Aiden, look at Aiden. Yep. Yep. A little late. Aiden steps around, going to have it knocked away. Aiden's got to let that guy fly by, and then it's got to – the trigger has to be quick going uh, – getting the shot off there. I thought Levi was going to grab it while he was still out of bounds. Akron pulls the three. Long rebound. That's another thing that I don't think gets coached a lot, Philip, is when that three when the three is shot, it's not gonna just dribble right off the rim. It's gonna be a big bounce on the rebound. And we had all of our guys real close to the rim on that rebound. rebound. Levi ends up coming out of there with it and he's gonna get fouled. Henry's at the scores table getting ready to check in. And he's going to get win. That's two shots. Yeah, two, two shots. shots. So Levi's going to go shoot some free throws. Be two shots. For everybody to I, out. I forget about. I'm still forgetting about that rule with the with the rule change there. There's Papa. Levi misses the first one. Aim at the front. Aim at the front. Aim at the front. Aim like just over the top, over the front. It depends on how tired I am. If I'm tired, I aim for the back. For the back. <laughs> the first part of the game, I'm aiming at the front of the room. Yeah. The last he, part of the game, I'm aiming for the back of the room. He missed both of those. Reed's going to going to poke it away from behind, and it's going to go out of bounds. It's going to stay with Aiken. I always say that a good shooter don't miss left and right. He misses long and short. Yeah. That's a double dribble. Levi's taking it out of bounds. Oh, Lucas, got a, Lucas got a dribble. Like, like, I, like I get it. He's He's young. He's he. You know. just told him, fake that pass and dribble around. Yeah, he he's young. Um, Did you ever watch Smart Guy? Smart Guy. I don't guess uh, so. With T.J. Henderson, the Disney show. No. Nah. Oh man, guy down here reminds me of Mo of Smart Guy. I don't know. I don't know that show. Maybe that. Maybe I'm too old for that one. I mean, it was a good one, man. We, you need to we, get it on Disney Plus and watch it. It was a good one. We ain't that we ain't that far apart, but big bounce there. Aiken tracks it down. 
rebound the basketball. Yeah, guy. got a rebound. We're so far under the goal on these rebounds. We're jumping late. Reed's fighting for it. He just had that one taken away from him. 34 seems to walk quite a, quite a bit whenever he's got the ball. Man, they're going to call a walk there. Right. They got about seven rebounds right they there. They did. You, you got a rebound. Zero points. Levi and Reed are going to check out. Drake comes in. And Wynn checks back in. Wynn's going gonna, gonna to break the press. Gets it to Henry on the wing. This is a pretty young team that's in right now. Let's see. How, what, how, what, Drake is a ninth grader. Gets it into Aiden. Aiden's going to get fouled. They're shooting some free throws. We've got two ninth graders and three eighth graders on the floor right now. So Aiden's going to step up, shoot these free throws. He gets the first one to go. Missed it. Oh, I thought Wynn was going to come out of there with that one. I yeah, he was going to throw it away. He wasn't ready for it. Lucas almost had that one. Drake tips it. I, I, he was our, he was our early. Time is, our time that timing is bad. So bad. It is bad right now because the other ones have been late and Drake was early that time. Drake's gonna get called for a foul. So this is where I guess I guess the whole five foul rule is the is encouraging you not to foul and try to not. I guess it would not extend or I guess it would extend the game because the clock stops. But especially the first half it encourages you not to. I don't know. I, Not I, like, foul. I like it better the old way. I like it better the old way, too. Missed both of them. Wins, get the rebound. Gets it to Henry. Henry's going to drive. Kicks it back out to Lucas. Step back three. Oh. Oh, in and out. Henry's down there fighting for it, and he just couldn't get it. And it's going to be a jump ball. It's going to go to Akron. Well, that'd be all right. We'll get the ball back up to half. Oh, I bet there's a jump in this uh, 47 seconds. I bet there's a foul. Well, I know there's a foul right there. Right there. There's another one. 34 is going to get called for it, for it. So Aiden's going to go shoot some more free throws. See, that's where it kills you when you get five. If you foul all the way down there under your basket, it walks down to your to the other end shooting free throws. And not just the one and one, it's two. two. No matter what, it's two. Oh, I mean, I see what their point was. It's like you got to get ten fouls theoretically before you're shooting because it's five and five and a quarter or whatever instead of seven. Right. But. Which bank was this? Was this the. Was, I was. Uh, now I'm scared farmers, to say, I'm scared to say it because farmers or diamonds. I don't want to say the bank that's not our sponsor. Okay, uh, he missed that one, but Henry got the rebound. Henry got to go up. He got fouled too, so Henry's gonna go shoot free throws. Farmers or diamonds? I think this is farmers. This one was diamonds. The banks ain't open right now. They just closed about thirty minutes ago. Oh, oh man, that was a three that's been in and out. That yep. free throw, it touched everything but the bottom. Yep. Back of the rim. Thought Drake had pretty good position. Henry steals it, and he's going to get blocked. It's going to be Spring Hill's ball on the baseline. Gets it to win. Win's going to have it knocked away. And it's going to be off off Lucas. Akron's going to throw it away with 13 seconds left. 
All right, please, let's settle for one shot, guys. One shot. Right. Unless you get something wide open. Luke is breaking. He pulls it out. Henry pump fakes. Tried to kick it. Wynn's going to steal it. And Wynn gets it to go. And that looked like a little contact there. He blowed it. I think. He should have blowed it. Yeah, he's going to get a free throw, huh? No, they ain't gonna, he ain't gonna give it to him. But that's a that's a just finishing through contact, which is what you like to see uh, from from an eighth grader. There, twenty three eleven is gonna be the score going into halftime, and we'll be back with you for the start of the third quarter. You want an education that's gonna take you places. To know that your instructors are going to support you when the work gets hard and cheer you on when you succeed. You want programs that fit with your busy life, challenge you, and put you on the path to the career you've always wanted. And you want to stay out of debt. At UAHT, you can. You don't want your education to be on hold. You want an education in HVAC that prepares you for good jobs right now. Where your instructors teach you the skills you need to be competitive. You want to be prepared to enter the workforce immediately. And you want to stay out of debt. At UAHT, you can. Is your system struggling to keep up? Experience the comfort of Yates Maintenance Heating and Air. It is our mission to provide world-class service and HVAC solutions backed by our certified indoor air quality expertise. Visit YatesMaintenance.com to find out more. You want an education that's going to take you places. To know that your instructors are going to support you when the work gets hard and cheer you on when you succeed. You want programs that fit with your busy life, challenge you, and put you on the path to the career you've always wanted. And you want to stay out of debt. At UAHT, you can. Is your system struggling to keep up? Experience the comfort of Yates Maintenance Heating and Air. It is our mission to provide world-class service and HVAC solutions backed by our certified indoor air quality expertise. Visit YatesMaintenance.com to find out more. You want an education that's going to take you places. To know that your instructors are going to support you when the work gets hard and cheer you on when you succeed. You want programs that fit with your busy life, challenge you, and put you on the path to the career you've always wanted. And you want to stay out of debt. At UAHT, you can. 
You don't want your education to be on hold. You want an education in HVAC that prepares you for good jobs right now, where your instructors teach you the skills you need to be competitive. You want to be prepared to enter the workforce immediately, and you want to stay out of debt. At UAHT, you can. Is your system struggling to keep up? Experience the comfort of Yates Maintenance Heating and Air. It is our mission to provide world-class service and HVAC solutions backed by our certified indoor air quality expertise. Visit YatesMaintenance.com to find out more. You want an education that's going to take you places. To know that your instructors are going to support you when the work gets hard and cheer you on when you succeed. You want programs that fit with your busy life, challenge you, and put you on the path to the career you've always wanted. And you want to stay out of debt. At UAHT, you can. All right, getting getting back with you, getting ready for the start of, of the third. Waiting on the officials now, though. So it looks like the original five is going to come back. Some of them got in some early foul trouble. Uh, Caleb got in early foul trouble. Um, Parker come down. He got the got the charge that I don't think was a charge. And then, uh, then like, right down on the other end, like, boom, boom. Like, I thought his hands were straight up. Must have got him with the body. So. Here they come. There's Mo, Curly, and Larry. Oh, uh, don't start that. Then, then they'll be all on us. All right, here we go. Spring Hill's going to have, have possession of the ball. Oh, ah, Wynn was there. Wynn, Wynn was just, he was coming out. He wasn't ready for that pass to be made. Yep. Caleb's gonna kick it. It's probably a kickball. Kick yeah, it hits his foot anyways. That's two turnovers. First two possessions for Spring Hill is gonna be two turnovers. It's turnovers. Ah, oh, no, it's no, that's a good save. It's a good hustle. Akron pulls the three. It's going to be a big, big rebound. Parker's going to get it. Gets it out to Reed. 
see if we can get a good shot here because we've had a couple turnovers. Akron's packed it in. Parker spin moves, going to be short. Wind's fighting for it, and it's going to be a jump ball, so it's going to be Akron. Parker's still a little ginger on his ankle. Akron breaks the press pretty easy. Pulls it back out. Big bounce on the three. Wind gets it, and he pulls it back. Ooh, got to be careful with that one. Reed drives, kicked it to Caleb, pulls the corner three, short, way short. He wasn't set. He was kind of kind of falling there. Caleb's going to get called for the third one. Oh, no, they're going to call it, call it a strip, luckily. Parker's going to sub out. Aiden comes in. Parker, Parker twisted his ankle early. Shot. Him up. Send him back out. Tape it up tight anyway. Caleb on the corner. Reed catch on the wing. He pump fake drives, dumps it off to Aiden. Aiden. Go up. Yeah. Go up. Go up. Go He's got to go, go up and got to go up. Don't take that dribble. Just go up. That was cool little move. Yeah, a little behind, behind the back. back. Stop. stop. And pull up. Yep. Yeah. Kick it to Levi. Levi pulls up. Short. Reed with the rebound. He flips it up. No good. Caleb with the rebound. It's going to be knocked away. Spring Hill's ball on the baseline. Levi catches it on the, on the corner. Gets it to win. Win kicks it back out to Caleb. Moves it around to Aiden. Aiden. Cannot let the ball go down. He cannot take that dribble there. He's got it. He's just he's big, a big kid. He's just got to be. Like, tough. He's got to be tough, like Maynard. Yes. More aggressive. And that's one thing he's not. He's ne- he's never been been very aggressive. Levi drives, and it's going to be knocked away. But it, it ends up going off of Levi. So the press has gotten backed up because Akron has beat it a couple times. Aiden knocks it away. I tell you, it's pretty well money when he dribbles it behind the <laughs> Yeah. He's made two that way. Levi on the wing. Caleb from the corner. He had his feet set, but he still he missed that one long. The last one was short. Maybe he overcompensated that time. Yeah. He don't get called for a carry. Does it that coach is he has we've seen him I mean, other than maybe at Akron, but I feel like I've seen him coaching somewhere else before. Maybe it's a different kid. I say kid. That's that's a super hard pass. Reed's driving and then tries to jump, dump it right like two feet from where he's going. Now the press is back on. Aiden's going to get called for the foul. Got to move his feet is what his mama just yelled, and I agree with him. play much first half. He was in foul trouble. Yeah, he got that free throw to go. Talking about the guys in the free throws. Mm-hmm. Got that one to go. They've made a couple, and we've not got real, very, really good, uh, very many looks this this quarter. Good quality looks, anyway. We ain't scored this quarter. Needs to go home and watch Bill O'Neill Holler. Yep. And how angry he was the whole time he. Yep. Levi with the rebound. 
He gets it to Reed. Levi drives in, kicks it to Aiden. Yeah, but she's got a strong. He's got to go up stronger. Well, you got to understand that they're not going to call every little bit of contact on no. the, the play. Caleb with the rebound. He wanted to go long to win, but they had a defender back. That's a tough pass to make, too. I like where Reed's head's at making that or trying to go there, but that's just a hard pass to make. Reed just got just kind of got beat there. He gambled trying to get a steal. He gambled trying to get a steal. That's for a wonderful way. Yeah. If you're going to gamble, you're going to have to make sure you, you make pay dirt there. And Wynn wasn't looking for the ball. Right, here's the deal. I said we couldn't go through one of those six-minute scoring droughts, and we're on five minutes right now. That's right. And you, you need to calm them down. Like, just make the plays you was making in the first half because we, we were making really good plays. BSE Spray Services, pesticide, herbicide, and aquatic application for residential and commercial. Farmers Bank and Trust, easy banking for busy living. Visit myfarmers.bank. Randy's Collision Center. A collision is stressful, but the collision repair process doesn't have to be. Bring your car to Randy's Collision Center, and we'll get you back on the road in no time. We appreciate our sponsors. Make sure you, if you're on Facebook, you share and like it. Make sure if you're on, uh, if you have a, if you have YouTube, uh, make sure you go and subscribe to our YouTube channel. And make sure if you're staying up, you need want local news, Swark's got you. If you want Razorback news, Swark got today. They post that stuff too. KJ's in the portal. Thank goodness. Well, at least you know. Now we could just get Sam in the portal. Okay. There's another score from Spring Hill. Yep. Or not from from Acorn. Spring Hill hasn't scored this quarter, and that's a dangerous pass. Wynn gets it, flips it to Parker, and Parker gets it to go. See how strong he was when he went up there? Aiden has to be strong because Aiden, Aiden can get in some really good position. It's not, it's, it's not that Aiden's not strong. No, he just – he's just he, – we got to tweak his mind. We need to get his mindset tweaked to where he's like – can be mean – at times, but he's just not a mean kid. If you if you know him, you know he's not a mean kid. Parker airballed that one. Brandon's gonna check in. Switching defenses up. Nobody didn't make that because he didn't drill behind his back. Exactly. Tried to go ahead to win, couldn't track it down. Yeah. Wonder if the between I wonder if a between the leg dribble is the same as behind the back. Twenty two pulls it from deep and he gets it to go. Brings it to one. Reed's gonna flip it. I don't think he got rid of it in time. It didn't matter because it was no good anyway. Fourth quarter. Yep. You scored two points in the third. And that's just like, that's a long time to go without having any points. And they didn't come till 45 seconds left? Almost a minute. Under a minute. Advantage Self Storage, a family-owned and operated company dedicated to serving both residential and commercial storage needs. Wiley's Glass and Salvage, your premier source for all your auto parts and glass needs. If we don't got it, we can get it. Unity Baptist Church. We have a place for you. And Big Mac's Barbecue. Stop by and try our daily lunch specials and mouth-watering barbecue. 33. I, the girls are, I just saw Aikens girls headed to the locker room. I remember 33 from last year. She was really good. Ball yep, she, she's pretty good. So, so she'll be on the radar, uh, I'm sure, for the girls. 
girls want some close ones. Hopefully they can keep that momentum going, keep winning some ball games down the stretch here. Caleb's going to throw that one away. That's not a good omen. That's how we started the third, too. Looks like we've changed it up a little bit. Back into our 1-3-1, maybe. Pump fake. Number four pulls it. Big bounce. Wynn gets the rebound. No, he's not. Reed. Yeah. Tried to get it to Brandon. <laughs> 22 drives right down the middle of the lane. Brandon didn't know what defense we were in right there. Akron takes the first lead, their first lead of the game. Brandon flips it up in the end. He almost lost that one. But he's able to gather it back up. Ford's going to dribble it around. Got a rebound. Levi tips it. Levi ends up with it. Make a smart decision. And... There's some contact there. They're going to say it's Spring Hill's ball. Levi catch and shoot, and he's going to get fouled. That's the second, second or third time we've been able to get a pass right there. Your coach is fixing the sub. That was on third. He's only got two. 22 thought it was on him, but it wasn't. Got to make the free throws. Man. Man, it's too far. I mean, shoot it. Don't throw it. That one was a little flat itself, but his shot looked a little bit better. Got to get back because Akron's pushing it up the floor. Ooh. Excuse me. It's going to be Spring Hill's ball. Deflected. Oh, it's a ball, Levi. Well, it was, it was tipped, too. Akron takes a timeout. Lucas has at the scores table, so I'm, I'm guessing he's getting ready to check in. Caleb's going to take a break. UAHT. Graduates from Spring Hill High School can attend UAHT for free. Their first year with the Hempstead Guaranteed Scholarship. Visit uaht.edu slash Hempstead Guarantee to learn more. Caney Creek Estates, a a family-friendly community and affordable living. That one's tripped me up twice tonight already. Diamond Bank, the natural choice for community banking. And Yates Maintenance, heat and air experts for your home or business. Senior girls coming up next. I'd like to know what, what's our conference record? For which one? Um, I'll, I'll find out after the after the break. After this quarter, I'll find out. Wynn steps in front of that one. Wynn's going to get fouled. Wynn's got a – Wynn's still not shooting the ball a whole lot right now. Maybe that's just because he's an eighth grader and he's still learning a little bit. He's got to learn to just – just take, like, you're already at the free throw line down. And, like, go ahead and take that. He shoots one there. Tough shot. Brandon with the rebound. He goes back up. Short. Lucas going to try to flip it up, and it's going to stay at Spring Hill. Hey, Brandon, Brandon's eighth grader. Right? Brandon's an eighth grader. So Brandon's eighth, wins eighth. Lucas is eighth. Lucas is eighth. 
fly next year. Yeah, I mean they're get, they're getting some meaningful minutes right now. You're you're gonna lose some size. Yeah, Henry be an eighth grader. Henry's an eighth grader. Uh, Shoot a week. Oh, uh, trip uh, is it trip? No, no, that's Christopher. He's an eighth grader too, and he's played some. Lucas steals it there and ends up getting it to win. We need to get this set up here. Levi Drive almost slipped. Win dumps it to Brandon. Brandon kicks it back out. Levi pulls the three. No good. Got to get back here. He's gonna call. He's gonna be step step on the baseline. So it's gonna be out of bounds and be back to Spring Hill. Little press here. Lucas drives. A basket would be real big right here. Turnover no. would not be. No, luckily that one. Levi saved you one from that one there. Wynn's going to pull it short. Wynn's going to get called for the foul. All of our shots look super flat, Phillip. Super flat and super hard. Like Caleb's checked back in. Lucas is going to go out. Lucas hustles while he's in there. It's like with our shots, it's like we're throwing it at the front of the rim instead of trying to make it go over the front of the rim. Right. Sorry, I just yawned, too. It's going to be knocked away from Caleb. It's going to stay off of Caleb, so it's going to stay with Aiken. I don't know how he made that. I don't know. Tossed it up there, I guess. Akron takes the lead now. That's a steal. Yep, and a layup. Timeout, Spring Hill. Hmm. Hyford Medical Services, let us take care of everything. Brazil Ocrest Funeral, the funeral home, we care. Sorry. Heather Manor Nursing and Rehabilitation, providing your loved ones with the care they deserve. I get caught up watching other stuff, looking at my phone to see who who my, uh, what you call it, uh, my roster. Now I'm trying to get back to it. There it is. All right. We have scored 20, let's think. We scored 23 in the first half. Scored four points in the last 10 minutes. Yep, not going to win a lot of ball games doing that. Need to move the ball, which Parker being out hurts you a little bit. Caleb from the corner, and he gets it to go. Tied it up. Yeah. You, that was a big shot. You needed that shot. Now you got to play good defense. That's a travel. All right. Got a chance here. I mean, because you was leading, like, what, 23 to 11, I think is what the score was at halftime? Yeah, you was up by over 10. Reed's going to step on the baseline or on the, on the sideline. Wynn comes out of there with it. Smart smart move by Wynn there. And Wynn's going to get fouled. Akron's getting ready to sub. Still a long ways from shooting, though. Yeah. Well, I'll say that. Two, Two fouls. fouls. Mm-hmm. 
118. Not going to meet the ball when it's thrown to you. I didn't do it in school either. But, man, that is going to get called for a double dribble. Not going to meet the ball. I didn't do it in high school either because it's just not something that you think about. That's the second time they did that. Yeah. That, they just take it out before the ref gets it yep. and gives it to them to start the clock. They just, like, like street ball type stuff, just get it and go. Reed's going to get a steal. Well, Caleb gets up with it. We've moved to a triangle and two. Levi tried to kick it to Reed, and we're going to throw it away. We just get so crazy sometimes. I don't know what Justin said, but it's at all. What did he say? Yeah. What did he say, Pacer? I just know he said all five of you. Spring Hills ball. It's, turn, it's it's turned into a little bit of a turnover battle here going on right now. Look, drive the ball to the basket. Yeah, Brandon's fouled. wide open back there. Drive the ball to the basket and get fouled. Brandon's going to have it. He drives, and he's going to get fouled. So now he's going to go line shooting free throws. Now you're getting two shots. That's what you got to do. I guess that one to go. The big shot. Time out, Aker. PSE Spray Services, pesticide, herbicide, and aquatic applications for residential and commercial. Farmers Bank and Trust, easy banking for busy living. Visit myfarmers.bank. Randy's Collision Center. A collision is stressful, but the per, the collision repair 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 process. No, bring your car to Randy's Collision Center, and we'll get you back on the road in no time. You sound like you sound like me. You can't get the word out. My voice don't work very good, Brody. And I told you. Huh? My voice don't work very good. Well, it helps when the mic is turned towards your mouth and not straight up in the air. People don't want to hear me talk anymore. Well, they probably don't want to hear me talk either, but they just don't have a choice if they're going to. If you ain't in the gym you, and you're watching this, it's all, we all you got. You got, you got mute. I guess you could watch. Hey, I have to watch some of the uh, Razorback games on mute because I get tired of listening to them talk about the Razorback. Make me mad. They're not doing very hot this year. Well, he's, he takes him a little while to get it figured out. He'll get it figured out. Missed that one. They're going to call a foul on Caleb. It was a foul. Brandon's going to get called for a foul. On the floor. It's on the floor. Brandon jumped because he thought he was going to shoot it. And Brandon's knee might have caught him in the face. Twenty-two five. Twenty-two five. Yep, they've been there. They've been the scores. Wind knocks it away. That may have been some of the best defense we've we've had so far. Akron's going to take a full timeout. So you got to you got to play defense for 14, 14 more seconds. Yep. So it's going to be a big possession here. If you can just get a turnover, play defense, keep them in front of you, get a rebound. That's the thing, Philip. Is you got to, you got to rebound in this situation. They can't get a second chance opportunity here, and that's something we've struggled with. A lot of the a lot of our teams 
have struggled with um, in the past. Uh, just just allowing a lot of second chance points. We've got as much size as they've got. We've got, we should have more. We have a little bit bigger size, if I was guessing. That can't be an excuse. That can't be an excuse. A lot of the times it is because like, we, we tend to be – on the small smaller side. side, the smaller side than most people. Somehow I don't know how, why that was such a such a big deal because that was not the case for when I was in school. We had some big old dudes play when I was in school. It's come out most of soccer here. Uh, it it is. I mean, this year well, you had Colin one year, pretty good size. Well, he's he's just tall. Yeah. Like he's he's more of a guard. Yeah. I mean, you've never had like a. He could jump with anybody. You could. He could. Yeah. Yeah. Austin. Austin ain't going to get out of jump. Oh. Levi with the hard foul. That's, I mean, when you get, when he gets back, gets back there that open, that's, that's a good foul from Levi. That's a good foul. I mean, that's a hard, that's a lot of contact coming at you. And he wasn't malicious coming at him either. That was just a good hard foul. Now you put the pressure on him to make his free throw. And he gets the first one to go. So now, six seconds. Who missed that one? Wynn's Win, going to have it. It's off a of win. It's going to stay with Akron. Akron's going to take another timeout. Do we do overtime in? Uh... They do overtime because it's conference. Oh, man. Because it's it's a it's a conference game. Aker and do our coin flip. What did, who was it that I read some? Was it maybe it was our first and second grade group? Were they the ones that like supposed to shoot the free throws? Yeah, free throws? I, I didn't get that. Out. That was not an option Saturday. It I had to tell two people that uh, look, no no overtime. Yeah, hey. sorry. Hey, it was a long day up here. That up here, but yeah, I thought I thought that was a rule for somebody that I. That was, it in. It was the, the four on the floor shoot a free throw. Yeah. Advantage Self Storage, a family owned and operated company dedicated to serving both residential and commercial storage needs. Wiley's Glass and Salvage, your premier source for all your auto parts and glass needs. If we don't got it, we can get it. Unity Baptist Church, we have a place for you. And Big Mac's Barbecue, stop by and try our daily lunch specials and mouth watering barbecue. You know, Philip, every time I read that, and we on the we on the air. I think back to Fort Ice last year when we were trying to get them barbecue barbecue nachos, nachos and we, ne- we by the time we got done with our game, they had sold out. You no, know, I was very upset about that. I could go for some barbecue nachos. All right, look, this is what we want to happen. We want them to have to try to call a timeout and sc- five seconds. He got a shot up. They're going to say it's good. It looked good to me. Ball game. That's why he got rebound. That's a that's a tough one right there. Um, you hate to lose one that way. Uh, right there, off of a off of a second chance rebound. That's that's just a it's a heartbreaker right there. Especially when you was up twenty three eleven at the half, and you just you just couldn't get nothing going in the third. Um, senior girls, I don't I don't I hadn't really heard much about their girls, Philip, but thirty three, uh, she is down there. I remember her from last year, and that's uh, she she was a good player. So um, we'll see what the senior girls got, and we got about ten minutes. What they just put on the clock, so we got about ten minutes, and the senior girls, and we'll be back with you for the start of that game. Is your system struggling to keep up? Experience the comfort of Yates Maintenance Heating and Air. It is our mission to provide world-class service and HVAC solutions backed by our certified indoor air quality expertise. Visit YatesMaintenance.com to find out more. You want an education that's going to take you places. To know that your instructors are going to support you when the work gets hard and cheer you on when you succeed. 
You want programs that fit with your busy life, challenge you, and put you on the path to the career you've always wanted. And you want to stay out of debt. At UAHT, you can. You don't want your education to be on hold. You want an education in HVAC that prepares you for good jobs right now. Where your instructors teach you the skills you need to be competitive. You want to be prepared to enter the workforce immediately. And you want to stay out of debt. At UAHT, you can. Is your system struggling to keep up? Experience the comfort of Yates Maintenance Heating and Air. It is our mission to provide world-class service and HVAC solutions backed by our certified indoor air quality expertise. Visit YatesMaintenance.com to find out more. You want an education that's gonna take you places. To know that your instructors are going to support you when the work gets hard and cheer you on when you succeed. You want programs that fit with your busy life, challenge you, and put you on the path to the career you've always wanted. And you wanna stay out of debt. At UAHT, you can. Is your system struggling to keep up? Experience the comfort of Yates Maintenance Heating and Air. It is our mission to provide world-class service and HVAC solutions backed by our certified indoor air quality expertise. Visit YatesMaintenance.com to find out more. You want an education that's going to take you places. To know that your instructors are going to support you when the work gets hard and cheer you on when you succeed. You want programs that fit with your busy life, challenge you, and put you on the path to the career you've always wanted. And you want to stay out of debt. At UAHT, you can. You don't want your education to be on hold. You want an education in HVAC that prepares you for good jobs right now. Where your instructors teach you the skills you need to be competitive. You want to be prepared to enter the workforce immediately. And you want to stay out of debt. At UAHT, you can.
Network bringing you breaking news and sports coverage. Is your system struggling to keep up? Experience the comfort of Yates Maintenance Heating and Air. It is our mission to provide world-class service and HVAC solutions backed by our certified indoor air quality expertise. Visit YatesMaintenance.com to find out more. You want an education that's going to take you places. To know that your instructors are going to support you when the work gets hard and cheer you on when you succeed. You want programs that fit with your busy life, challenge you, and put you on the path to the career you've always wanted. And you want to stay out of debt. At UAHT, you can. Is your system struggling to keep up? Experience the comfort of Yates Maintenance Heating and Air. It is our mission to provide world-class service and HVAC solutions backed by our certified indoor air quality expertise. Visit YatesMaintenance.com to find out more. You want an education that's going to take you places. To know that your instructors are going to support you when the work gets hard and cheer you on when you succeed. You want programs that fit with your busy life, challenge you, and put you on the path to the career you've always wanted. And you want to stay out of debt. At UAHT, you can. You don't want your education to be on hold. You want an education in HVAC that prepares you for good jobs right now. Where your instructors teach you the skills you need to be competitive. You want to be prepared to enter the workforce immediately. And you want to stay out of debt. At UAHT, you can. All right, getting ready for the start of the senior girls game. Livy, Ava, Blakely, Kenzie, and Andrea are going to be the five starting out for the Lady Bears. I'm going to say you got to watch number 33. And I remember 20 as well. Hey, she took a ride to her. Yep. Andrea tips it away, and it's going to be Spring Hills ball. He's pointing this way. Yeah, it's going to be Spring Hills ball. Hey, 
I remember 20 now, Philip, too, after I seen her and her, her number. Yep. Uh, that's a that's that's kind of sailed on her right there. I like that when when they do stuff like when she, like Ava made that pass. I like where her mindset is at and where she's trying to go. It's just a really hard pass to make. We're matched up. Looks like Kenzie got the got the job of guard number thirty three, and she just kind of caught it, and went right back up. She got sealed, man. Yep. Well, she is trying to have trying to help too. That's two. Yep. Just calm down, calm down. I I didn't get the and Philip. I told you I'd get the record, but I didn't. I got caught up talking to somebody else. Didn't didn't talk to nobody. Seventeen and three is what Akron is. Man, it's a lot of basketball games. Well, they don't play football. What's Spring Hill? Five and six. Yep. And most of those have been recent in conference wins because our non-conference schedule. That's crazy. we just we they didn't play twenty games. Yep. Well, they don't play football. Which has always been crazy to me because I, you think most 2A schools are going to play football, but there's a few that don't. Well, there's probably more than a few. There's there's a few in our that we play that that don't. Pick and roll. Yep, that's good defense right there from Kenzie, uh, Jaden, and then being able to drop back on our girl as well. Andrea fighting for it, couldn't get it. Tipped by Ava. Five pulls it. <laughs> Blakely's oh, out. She tried to cross over and it got t- tipped away from her. Just work the ball. Work the ball. Get you a good shot. Now try to get it into the high post area. And it's going to be deflected. That's three turnovers in a row, though, Phillip. And that's one thing you, you didn't want to open the ball game with. Got to keep your hand up. Yeah, luckily she she didn't make that shot. Ava's going to drive. Passes it. It's going to be deflected. So it's going to be yeah, springing the ball. Should have just pulled that one up. She either should have pulled. Well put. And I thought I thought Blakely coming to the other her left side was was a better option in my observation. Blakely pulls and catches or catch and pulls it from the corner. Livy's going to get the rebound. She ended up taking it away. Now Ava's going to end up with it. Livy pulls the That's three. Oh, oh, just, just short. short. And that could be a jinx because we said that at the exact same time. I mean, it looked good. It looked good because right here where we were from, from the angle, we were both sitting at. Kenzie's going to get called for the foul. That's one of those uh, screen and alley oop play designs, trying to get 33 on the backside wide open. Trying to get the best player of the ball. Hmm. She got that free throw to go. Blakely with the rebound. She's out pushing. Kicks it to Andrea. Akron's defense rotates pretty well. Andrea, I'd rather say Andrea just catch and shoot it there and, instead of taking that dribble Wait, out. The dribble took yeah. too long. The matchup defense I, I like, but but there's got to be a lot of help and a lot of communication that that's being being relayed. Ooh, wall. Yeah. Can't guard a wall. No, nope. it's tough. It is tough. We we saw that from first and th- or first and second grade. And hey, look, guys. We gotta quit. We gotta take better care of the basketball. Andrea. 
Andrea's up top with Ava. Little runner from, from Livy and it couldn't get it to go. I mean, not a terrible shot. No, it's not a terrible that. shot. Yeah, I mean, that's probably one of that's the one, best shots we've got. One good thing Akron does is they're not going to give you many offensive rebounds. No, and they're going to get out and push the ball a little bit. Stop, stop stopping in those corners. That that bothers me, too. Back to Ava. She's going to shoot it. Ava's going to go shoot some free throws. I like when Ava's aggressive. Like, I mean, that was just a pass and, and pass cut, and, cut and, and, and got it right back. And one thing with Ava is she's got she's got to look to be a scorer. I mean, that's she, she's one of your seniors. She's got to look look at being a scorer. I'm not saying shoot the ball every, every time down the floor, you know, but like she's got to look for her opportunities and she's got to shoot it with, with the ability that we've seen her shoot it with in the past couple of years. She did get the first free throw to go there. And the second one. Andrea's going to be on the ball here. Akron sub. Did they sub too? Yes. You got a rebound though. You got a rebound. She will eat. She will eat all day. Well, you can't let her. Can't. That's what Kyle was saying. You can't let her cross your face. She crossed her face. You know, you got to. Kenzie catch it. Kicks it back out to Ava. Good ball movement. Blakely's gonna go up. It's gonna be just a little short, and she's gonna get called for the foul. Akron's defense moves really – they they uh, rotate really well. The ball movement has been really, really good for the girls at last position too. Akron's going to turn it over. Good. Oh, good pass from Ava. Caught her sleeping. Yep. And you you got to take advantage of those like, that's like that right there. No, no. You can't. No, you can't. You if can't. you front her, yep. if you front her, you better have somebody on the backside to help. That's exactly right. He's got all seven, I think. You can't throw over, over the top of her either. She runs the floor really well, too, Philip. She's just running the floor, watching the ball with her hand up. I wonder where she's going. Uh, my it. guess would be like OBU or something like that. Ava pulls it from the wing, and she gets to go. Ava, that's what I've, that's what I've been wanting to see from Ava. It's going to be Spring Hill's ball. Ava Max is going to come in for Kenji. She's going to guard 33 now. Be a, that'd be a good, uh, that should be a good matchup. Yeah, that's going to be a senior on a 10th grader. She's aggressive for a 10th grader. There's not a, oh, that's two good passes from Ava right there. And the coach is not happy about it. When, Ava, when, a, when Ava's got the mojo going, she, she can really get it going. Passing, shooting, I mean, she's she's doing a lot right now. UAHT graduates from Spring Hill High School can attend UAHT for free their first year with Hempstead Guarantee Scholarship. Visit uaht.edu slash Hempstead Guarantee to learn more. Caney Creek Estates, a family-friendly community and affordable living. A, uh, Ava McBrayer might be able to front 33 a little bit better. Kenzie, she Just may have wait. a little bit, little bit more height on her than Kenzie does. Kenzie's super aggressive too. Yeah. So when she gets in front, she's she may be cheating a little bit, and I don't think Ava's going to cheat as much. And when you're fronting, you have to be like in contact with them. I bet I bet Akron girls got got in trouble for allowing two of those easy baskets right there. He had his look. 
flipboard out. He was dang sure doing some drawing on it. Good defense. Good. You just can't, you can't you can't let her get multiple rebounds. And I don't know where that foul come from. They're gonna have to block. That's exactly out. right. I don't know who yelled that. Somebody did. Well, they yelled, "Grab that ball!" But you know, it's good shoot, long, good job, baby. Spring Hills ball. It's going to be a jump. Coach Kaiser wants a wants a, a foul there. Blakely drives, steps through. She's going to get fouled. Go shoot some free throws. When Blakely's aggre- is it Blakely's always okay. fairly aggressive, but when she's when she's really driving to the lane and, and getting to getting to some spots, that's her game really. Really, really improves. Well, that is her game. She's got to make free throws. We say that a lot, too. you got to make it free throws. But it's a very important aspect of the game. Well, I mean, my, uh, that's, that's my favorite way to score is, is drive the ball to the basket mm-hmm. and either make a layup or get fouled. When you get fouled, you got to be able to, you know, I ain't saying you got to make all of them, but let's shoot 75 80%. Right. Ava. Yeah. Ava Fearfoy, I think. Not Ava McBray. Yeah, I think it's going to be. Uh, yeah, it's on Ava. Ava Crookwood. She's just Ava. The other one's Ava Mac. Is how I've been trying to do it, just so I can try to keep them straight in my head. Thirty-three makes the free throw, and the, it could it very well could come down to free throws tonight. I like I, I, mean, I think you should shoot. I mean, uh, at worst, a good tip. Oh, that's back court. Did the ball cross? Does the ball have to cross? Uh-huh. You sure? I don't it know. used to be a body part. Good defense from Ava. Blakely gets the rebound. We got to stop, stop letting, the, letting the ball well, be down there below your waist. I mean, when you get it, it's to your chest, elbows out. You give one or two elbows, they'll, they'll quit grabbing at it. Yeah, but you also don't want to try to get a cheap foul that way. I used to get some cheap ones that way. Did you have very many people start grabbing the ball out of your throat? That's a good point. That's a moving screen. <laughs> nah. They're going to call call Olivia for a foul there. If anything, Philip, I thought that was a moving screen. but Well, they should be shooting. Hmm. So now she's gonna go shoot free throws. I try not to get out, get on the refs too bad, but I don't agree with that one. And if their feet get tangled, it's kind of like pass interference when the wide receiver's feet get tangled up. You know, like it's yeah, just it kind goes, of part of it. Goes to the offense. She crossed the line. Somebody did. 14. No basket. How are you not... That's a push it in the back, man. Ava Mack down there fighting for it. it should have been two shots. Though. Yeah. Well, it's going to be two shots for Ava. She gets that one to go. Their coach is, is asking about something, but I can't, I can't, I don't know what he's. Spring Hill's got to be careful this last minute not, not to get no foul. Give them this free throw. 
And I forget about shot clock, Philip. But Golly. Is that two on Ava? He called that on Ava Matt. He said Ava got it clean. But Ava Mack must have got it with the pot. And that's two on her. And she hadn't she didn't get a whole lot of playing time. Nobody's got to get the shooter. Yep. She missed that one. Livy with the rebound. Oh, Kenzie had it stripped away from her. Blakely ends up stripping it away from 14. And that's going to be a blocking foul. Blakely's going to go shoot some free throws. Blakely wanted to try try tried to step around her, just couldn't couldn't get it, so just took it up into her, which is which is a good move. It's a little harder finish. Blakely gets that one to go. Short. That pass was, it was a little late, and it was high. That's where Livy needed to go with it. I don't know if you don't know why I want to call her Olivia tonight, but it's where Livy wanted to go with it. Go. Go. Yep. Twelve fourteen is going to be the score at the end of the first quarter. Diamond Bank, the natural choice for community banking. Yates Maintenance, heating air experts for your home or business. Patrick Medical Services, let us take care of everything. And Brazil Ocrest Funeral, the funeral home we care. Make sure you're following Swark on Facebook and make sure you have subscribed to the YouTube channel. Not a bad first half. First Not a bad quarter. first half. You missed some first free quarter. throws. It, and my my mind goes back to the first three possessions was turnovers. And that's just nerves, jitters, whatever you want to call it. You just got to gotta remain calm. And I, I know it's hard to do. I mean, high school kids trying to stay calm, it's, it's, it's difficult for them, you know, because Akron, is, it's, it's, a, it's a conference game. And, and – some implications moving down, moving down the line. Ugh. It's going to be Spring Hills ball. Starting five, going to be back out there. Blakely's going to get it. She drives, steps around, and she gets it to go. Good move. Yep. Whoever's on that backside when she makes that nip move needs to be cut into the big block. Ah, uh, got by. Yep. Well, Kenzie's afraid to help too much on that screen, but you she's going to have to. You can't give her a free run to the basket like no. that. Ava Mack and Layla are checking into the game. Andrea and Libby are going to take a break. Be a little bit more size here. Blakely from the corner. She's going to drive. Try to, oh, Ava, somehow Ava was able to <laughs> snatch that one out of the air and gets two to go. I 
I mean, yeah. So that's got to, if she's going to front, you got to have your backside help. He's going to have to come help on the backside. Yep. Blakely catches on a big block, spin. Wow. I can get I you don't want to let I can get too on too much of a roll. Akron is matched up now. Man, she just you he's gonna have to rebound. Layla's gonna get called for a foul. Somebody has to put a body on thirty three. I would I would get somebody and just be like, Look, when the ball goes up Push her, push her out, out of the way. Yes, because I mean, if you don't, she just barely jumping and getting get, and she just tip it to herself. I, I, I'd like to know how tall she really was, but she plays really tall. Darby has checked in. Darby with a good block out right there. And that's a foul. She's she's kind of smiling. She's like, like, are you sure? Are you sure there's something? I mean, I thought it was pretty clean. And it would have been if you wouldn't have hit her with your body. Because that's I forget about that a lot of the time. Is is oh good cut from Blakely. Blakely's gonna get fouled. That's two quick ones on five. Yeah. yeah. Layla's going to get it. Back to Ava in the corner. I'd like to see Ava with a little pump fake and drive right there. I'd like to see a really good screen get set. Tough pass. Yep. Ava comes out there with it with a little runner, and she gets fouled. Is that five again? Or no, that's two. Two and five, I don't know if they're sisters. Are they twins? Two and five look very, very similar for Akron. And I thought that might have been the second one on, on number five, but it's just number two's first one. Or the third one on five, excuse me. And Ava gets the gets that one to go. I'm trying to see number five's face now. See if I think they look like twins. They they look very similar. They're built a lot alike. Yeah, yeah. I think they're twins. And they really. be twins. That's a travel. Layla's going to bring the ball up the floor. Akron has switched to this man-to-man. Blakely kicks it out to Ava. Ava drives, kicks it right back to Blakely. Blakely's going to try to flip it up. Does it count? He says on the floor. He said it's on the floor. He said it's on the floor. That's three on five. Yep. And they were all they all come within the last two minutes. I really think it's been out of bounds first because it hit the shot clock. Spring Hill fans wanted to push there. It is, it's it's an aggressive game. Like, they're letting them play right now. So, you take advantage of that a little bit. Both sides. I 
It's over the back. That's over the back. Luckily, but the thing is, Philip, is we're still not putting a body on them. Like, like she just, it was just lucky that that girl was running and jumped jump. into her. Like, we don't put a body on nobody, and I don't understand. I just, that just blows my mind that we, that we can't, that we don't do that when the ball goes up. I always, I got called for fouls because I had too much contact. You know, you, you're trying to slam into somebody. I got called for some of those. Layla misses that first one. Well, the main deal is you first thing, block somebody out, you got to know where they are. Yep, got to find them to get that one to go. And it's like when we turn to find the rebound, we lose our guy. Yep. And we just we just miss rebounds all the time, like Darby gets up, can't get it to go. She gets rebound. She's gonna get fouled. So Darby's gonna go shoot free throws. Or is it Darby or Blakely? If I was Blakely, I'd walk to the line. I'd walk to the free throw line. I was on the line. I was That's on the guy. I was on me. the ground. It was on me, wasn't it? They fouled me. A little bit strong. Kenzie's going to check in. Ava Max going to take a break. Couldn't get either one of those. Darby with good help. Defense right there. going to be Spring Hills ball. Ava Mack getting ready to come in. I think, I think Kenzie may have got elbowed in the face. I think she just got, like, I think the girl, like, grabbed her face and, and pulled her head around. That's what it looked like. Somebody coming. Uh, Andrea come in for Blakely. I was like, why is Blakely sitting down? Because I only seen one come in, but Andrea checked in, too. Uh, come on. We can't do that. We can't turn that ball over. Yeah, like not right now. Sub, sub, sub. Libby's going to check in for Darby. Darby, come in and give you some good minutes. One's got a pretty good handle on her. She drove by, but guess who got a rebound? Got her, got another one, and then got fouled. The good news is, knock on wood, she hadn't made all of her free throws tonight. <laughs> She ain't made all her free throws, and she's not making the putbacks either. Right not now. right now, but those are high, those are extremely high percentage shots that she's shooting, Phillips. So they're fixing to go. I was going to tell you, she did she did hit not near a part of the rim just then. So I mean, you see one go through, you know that you know what they say. And she missed that one. Libby gets the rebound. Nope, that pass got red. Ava Mack with the rebound. She's got like three of them chasing her. Ava finally was able to get rid of it. One's going to get called for the foul. And Livy just got called for a tech. Wow. Livy, Livy's going to have to go shoot her free throws, though, isn't she? Yeah. So does she go? She go shoot her free throws. She's got to shoot her free throws. Then we should shoot the tech, tech free we, throws. Well, no, we should shoot the technical free throws first, and then we shoot these free throws. Or what? What are we doing? We're gonna shoot ours. Why does Ava shoot them? I guess because a player that got a technical can't shoot them. I don't. I don't know. He missed both of them. 
Now they'll go shoot two, and they get the ball because the tech happened after the after the ball. You know what I'm saying? I was, I thought that you shoot the two technical free throws, and then and then you shoot the where the play was. I don't know, but there's a, a whole lot of good free throw shooting going. <laughs> if you want to see a free throw shooting expedition, you come on out. We missed three in a row. Oh, and we got, we got one. So now it's Akron's ball. That's why they got to shoot free throws last. And I, I, I understand the frustration. They're on top of you, but she got called for a foul. There's no need for you to, to retaliate on it. And it Ava gets a rebound. Late retaliation. Too, yeah. She just got to cool. She got to keep the cool head. Oh, Ava just missed that one. Over the back. Look, I remember twenty from last year, and she she's a heck of a defensive player, but I don't she she's not going to hurt you too bad on the offensive end. Cause she missed a pretty a, a really good look right there, and I'm not saying that just because she missed a free throw, but or a layup or a layup or yeah a layup, but you've got to worry about the twins. And one penetration and 33, you've got to block her out. They're, they've got a good little ball ball team. But you got to make free throws. That's that's three in a row that we've missed. Now he was down there fighting for it. Jump ball. It's going to be Akron's ball. It's not a jump ball unless two people have possession. One hand is not considered possession. Was that one? Yeah. One's got a good shot. Andrea's got to go. She got nobody picked her up. He tried to change his defense up. And nobody picked Andrea up. Ooh. Uh, if I was able to back off of her, back off of her. It's going to be Spring Hills ball. I, mean, I would, if Corny's out there at the three point line, I yeah. would not be with yeah. 10 foot up. Well, now she just checked out. So that's going to change it up a little bit. It's going to change it up. Now you can't help as much, but I agree. I, so far from what I've seen, there's not too many of them that's going to take a bunch of threes because their game plan is to get it to 33. It's going to be another jump ball, so it's going to be Spring Hill's ball. You can't you can't let that physicality get in your head. You just have to match it if you're Spring Hill, because Akron a 14 and one right now are are extremely physical. Good defense from Ava Mack and a rebound from Ava. Blakely with the rebound. Now Layla with the rebound. Oh, good pass from Layla, and Blakely finished the wall. 33 looks tired to me, Phillip. She's having to work. I think two got two may have got away with two walks there. That's good front front defense right there. You can't make that, little, that lazy little bounce pass or throw that one away. Ava finally ends up with a rebound and gets it out to Ava Matt. Blocking foul, so Ava's going to go shoot free throws. The 
the reason that one's a block is because when they're set, when when you're standing there and they kind of make that little move and you lean over to it, that's what makes it a blocking. Libby and Kenzie are at the scores table. We had a we had quite a few turnovers right there in a row, Philip. They, yeah, they killed her. Like said, those just little stretches. That little we, stretches where we, we get the turnover bug. We get about two or three in a row, and it, it really hurts us because we started the game that way, but then you had a little flurry right there. Ten seconds here. That's pretty good defense, but you've got, you got—I just don't get it. You just, you've got to get her blocked out, and that's just one thing that we hadn't done is we haven't consistently been able to keep a body on her after she shoots it. You have to get her blocked out. Twenty-four thirty is going to be the score going in at halftime. We'll be back with you for the start of the third. Is your system struggling to keep up? Experience the comfort of Yates Maintenance Heating and Air. It is our mission to provide world-class service and HVAC solutions backed by our certified indoor air quality expertise. Visit YatesMaintenance.com to find out more. You want an education that's gonna take you places. To know that your instructors are going to support you when the work gets hard and cheer you on when you succeed. You want programs that fit with your busy life, challenge you, and put you on the path to the career you've always wanted. And you wanna stay out of debt. At UAHT, you can. your system struggling to keep up? Experience the comfort of Yates Maintenance Heating and Air. It is our mission to provide world-class service and HVAC solutions backed by our certified indoor air quality expertise. Visit YatesMaintenance.com to find out more. You want an education that's going to take you places. To know that your instructors are going to support you when the work gets hard and cheer you on when you succeed. You want programs that fit with your busy life, challenge you, and put you on the path to the career you've always wanted. And you want to stay out of debt. At UAHT, you can. You don't want your education to be on hold. You want an education in HVAC that prepares you for good jobs right now, where your instructors teach you the skills you need to be competitive. You want to be prepared to enter the workforce immediately, and you want to stay out of debt. At UAHT, you can.
Is your system struggling to keep up? Experience the comfort of Yates Maintenance Heating and Air. It is our mission to provide world-class service and HVAC solutions backed by our certified indoor air quality expertise. Visit YatesMaintenance.com to find out more. You want an education that's going to take you places. To know that your instructors are going to support you when the work gets hard and cheer you on when you succeed. You want programs that fit with your busy life, challenge you, and put you on the path to the career you've always wanted. And you want to stay out of debt. At UAHT, you can. Is your system struggling to keep up? Experience the comfort of Yates Maintenance Heating and Air. It is our mission to provide world-class service and HVAC solutions backed by our certified indoor air quality expertise. Visit YatesMaintenance.com to find out more. You want an education that's going to take you places. To know that your instructors are going to support you when the work gets hard and cheer you on when you succeed. You want programs that fit with your busy life, challenge you, and put you on the path to the career you've always wanted. And you want to stay out of debt. At UAHT, you can. You don't want your education to be on hold. You want an education in HV. All right, welcome back. Getting ready for the start of the third. Let's see. There we go. I had it spun around the wrong way. Now you can hear me, maybe. Getting ready for the start of the third. Waiting on the ref now. Our girls come out. Oh, the refs are out here. We're waiting, waiting on, on our practice. girls. <laughs> yeah, we switched headsets because that one's super loud. That's why we couldn't. That's why I couldn't hear you, cause cause you had your mic turned the wrong way. Maybe I turned it the wrong way. Original five on the floor for both teams looks like. No, I don't think it is. Fourteen didn't start, but that's because five got has foul trouble. Foul got trouble. Three fouls. Yeah. Good block. Blakely with the rebound. She dribbles out. Oh, good pass back from Olivia. I hate those passes. Yeah, it's a long way across there. Blakely pulls a three short. She tried to cut in there, just couldn't quite get there. Ah, uh, get back, Ava. Twenty got that one to go. I mean, you ain't gonna leave her. You might leave her open on the three-point line, but you can't let her let her shoot it from the lane. Akron's in a little bit different defense. Ava pulls the three. She gets it to go. I said last our last home game, Ava wasn't shooting with confidence, and now she is. You can tell she's got a little bit, little bit more pep when she shoots the ball. A little more confidence, I guess, is what you'd say. 
That's a good post move. Blakely, Marino. you got to drop down on that. I would let Blakely drop down and help on that. I don't think you're going to get her in a hurry. I don't think you can speed up 33. Yeah. But but you can make it more difficult. I said I would have, I would have dropped Blakely down. I think she, Blakely's quick enough. She could have jumped back out on the Libby three. from three. He gets it to go. Drop down. You're going to have to drop Kenzie's down. Got help. To, Kenzie's got to get into her, too. You well, can't just let her get that free right there. Well, or, or front her. Well, you can't. We, can, we already we said we can't front. If you front, I mean, like, you got to front her, but you got to have some help coming on the back side if you front her. And I think, I mean, I, I felt like it worked okay fronting her. Yeah, you do, you do have I to have help, help on the help back side. Like, Blakely gets it. And now she gets that one to go. Spring Hill's hanging with right now. You just got to get a stop. And that's what you got to do. Kenzie was a lot more physical that a lot time. More physical. Don't let her push you. Don't let her just stand down there and get it free. You got to push around a little bit. It's going to be Spring Hill's ball. Make her make her work for it. Where she's she's gonna be tired by the end of the game. <laughs> Andrew May got away with one right there. Livy chases the long rebound down, and she's gonna have it knocked away. I think she threw it off of that like girl's leg. Okay, it's hard to see all the way across the other side of the floor. Turn and shoot. Turn and shoot. Good move from Kenzie, and she may have got fouled, too. Livy with the rebound, put back. That's a tough shot to make. Kenzie can Oh. They're going to say off to Akron. I thought that was going to be a foul on Kenzie because she kind of gave her the old she body did. bump. i seen it, too. Oh, oh Livy, you got to make that one. That's one of them you got to have. There you go. Kenzie's making her work for it now. Blakely's going to get it. She's going to drive, knocked away. She ends up picking it back up. Ava's got two on one here. He may be on her back, but it's not over the back if there is no block out. I mean, it's that's just what it is. Good pass from Ava. That's the second one. Yeah. She's missed. Yeah. Point blank. Andrea's going to check oh, out. Oh, got it back out to eight. Yeah. Kenzie's going to check out. Ava comes, Ava Mack comes in, and Layla comes in. Ava's being aggressive, too. Ava Mack down there on 33. Layla with the defense. It's going to be off the apron. Blakely's going to drive. And that's quite a bit of contact. That's a clean block. Ava shoots it. That's a two. Blakely with the rebound. Akron comes out of there with it, and Ava and 33 are both on the floor. They both hit hard. Well, you got two down on this end, or you had two down on here, and and Akron had another one down on the other end. They, They both took a hard fall. Heather Manor Nursing and Rehabilitation providing your loved ones with the care they deserve PSE Spray Services Pesticide, Herbicide and Aquatic Application for Residential and Commercial 
Farmers Bank and Trust, easy banking for busy living. Visit myfarmers.bank. Everybody's going hard right now. Oh, man, I have to get one of those retaliation fouls. Mm. You hurt my guy, you're up to hurt you. It's going to be Akron's ball. Good, good defense by Layla. Yeah, Kenzie tracks it down. Blakely drives it on the baseline. And Blakely. Blakely up and under. Under. Yep. And then Ken- Kenzie did push her. Kenzie pushed her. She's got to be physical, though. She's only got two. I mean, she's got some fouls. Kenzie's down there fighting for it. Livy comes out of there with it. Good pull up from Kenzie. Just couldn't get it to go. Layla's going to kick it, so it's a kick ball. going to be Akron's ball on the baseline. Air ball, but you got to have that one. Livy's got three. I think I think Livy did that on purpose. That was the same girl that she got the key from. She fouled her pretty hard. Ava Mack is at the scores table. So she took a hard fall, but you didn't have to her knee a little bit. Yeah, she's got the she's got the pad on the knee. Livy's going to check out. That's three on Livy. Yeah. Olivia. I mean, it's, it's a foul. Now, is it a little? Can it, can it be a little ticky tack at times? It, it can. My deal is, it probably is what made her make a bad pass. It, it, it hit her it, in the arm. It did. Ava Mack just lost it, and they're gonna say, say we just she just lost it. That's what it looked like to me. I don't know. It may have got tipped. Tyler was closer. I'm gonna go with him. He said it got tipped. That's what he's telling the ref over there, too. Akron is sub-33. She's catching a break. And I got to give gotta give some props to Kenzie because Kenzie's been making her work down there for it, too. Kenzie with the rebound. Gets it out to Ava Mack. He did. I'd like to send her throw it to the corner. I did. I would too. Because Blakely was was there. Yeah. Darby's going to give Kenzie a break, which I think is a pretty smart move. Give her a break while 33 is getting a blow too. Right, step up. Let her go to the middle of the no. floor like that. No, right. not like that. Look at Ava Mack right there in the middle of the floor. That's a dangerous pass. Blakely from the wing. She just missed that one. 
sometimes you just so wide open it's it's hard to make it. Blackley tried to get that one. Good looking shot from five. You got to get that ball to uh, Ava Mack at the free throw line there. She's standing there wide open. There's so much you can do when you get the ball right there in the middle of the floor. Pass it, drive it, shoot it. I, I mean, try to get it. No, I try to tell my pee wee kids that same thing. I know, and it's just it's. Really? I don't know why it's and so you, hard to understand. You've understand got to have somebody there that's patient and that understand understand understands the situation. Like you do. You do. Shoe travel. You got to dribble the ball there. Uh, one back. NBA rules. One back. One back. She gathered, she's gathering it the first step. Clock, clock. Who has a late start? Akron's okay with settling for the last shot. They're, they're up right now. Blakely's going to have a, have a look at a layup, and she gets it to go. Right when I said I, you wouldn't, I, she makes a uh, contested shot. So, you know, you hate to you, you get an easy two and then you give up a, a, a good look there at the end, which is tough. Oh, that is tough. Help Bones to zoom in. Can we get some 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 audio on what those reps are saying down there, real quick, Bones? Yeah, because he's got his mouth covered. Randy's Collision Center. A collision is stressful, but the collision repair process doesn't have to be. Bring your car to Randy's Collision Center, and we'll get you back on the road in no time. Advantage Self Storage, a family-owned and operated company dedicated to serving both residential and commercial storage needs. What do you need to store that's commercial? I mean, I, I don't know. Maybe like the bread. The people store the bread, don't they? Isn't that where fish are getting dumped? Isn't his in a storage unit somewhere? I don't know. Well, I would think he went to the plant and picked up his bread. No, no, they they like bring trucks in and then they load it. I think it's the I think they have the, the little building out there by the college. I have no idea. No, I don't know. That's a good question though. What kind of uh, what was I saying? A commercial storage. Commercial thing? storage. That's, I mean, yeah. Maybe that's if you if you if you have a question about it, maybe go see our our people over there at, at Advantage Chef Storage and they can tell you about it. Because I really don't know what a commercial storage would be. I mean, may I guess maybe if you're a business and you need to store some product, maybe. We backed it into a two-three because thirty-three ain't on the floor. So but I don't think you can leave two and five open. It's got a rebound. It's just, it's just killing you, man. Blocked by the back corner of the backboard there. Blakely open. Kenny you got to turn and face the basket. Because you turn, you make 20 come to you. Livy's right there. I mean, or you, you can drive by it. her. If she comes out, you can put yeah. the whole on the drive. There's so, there's so much you can do right there. Blakely from the corner. She gets the three to go. You needed those three right there. Now you need a stop. Yeah, you got it down to single digits. Yeah. Kenzie with a good recovery, but she can't leave five open. She luckily she missed that one. Oh, right, two twenty. Yep. I mean, she gonna make it if she's in the lane.
That's Could be what. Spring Hills, yeah. Layla's going to check back in for Kenzie. I, I would put I'd put Blakely at, at the free throw line. So she could do that. All right, let's get a stop, a stop, and a stop, and no score. Rebound, man, it's just killing you. And and twenty ends up losing it down there. That could have been because of the because of the four goons down there standing on the wall. That's what I call them. Alex is one of them. And the boar. And, and the, the two of the moors. And I don't know who those are. Layla at the free throw line. Huh. Shoot the ball right there. You gotta do something. You can't make that pass in the double coverage. Look, that's, that's a pretty good move. Ava with the rebound. Five's going to get called for the foul. Five wanted over the back. That's Is that four? Yeah. So I bet she's coming out. 33 still on the bench. And I'm not, I don't, I mean, I think he's he don't saving want her for the last, the last, three minutes. last three. Yeah. I can't believe she's still over there. Maybe she just, maybe, maybe they really did get her tired. Blakely tried to go up and under, and, and she could just got blocked there. And Ava deflects it. 15 ends up with it, and that's just an easy, that's just an easy one. Spring Hill's going to take a timeout. Ava tips the ball, and it just went right to her, yeah. Last five minutes. Wiley's Glass and Salvage. Your premier source for all your auto parts and glass needs. If we don't got it, we can get it. Unity Baptist Church, we have a place for you. Big Mac's Barbecue, stop by and try our daily lunch specials and mouth-watering barbecue. We love, we appreciate all of our sponsors. We appreciate Swart Dot Today for getting getting here and getting this stuff set up. Me and Philip just show up, so make sure y'all are giving Swart Dot Today a follow on Facebook. And if you have your if you have a YouTube account. Make sure you subscribe. If you don't have a YouTube account, go create you one and then subscribe. I think it's a little bit easier to watch it on YouTube if you have an account. Because I know a bunch of people, like like my family, we switched to the YouTube TV, and that's so it's a little bit easier to watch that way. Streaming. We're, we're high rolling down here in the, in the boonies. I don't think I've ever watched it because I've always been on it. I've, been, I've always been on it, too. You would not. Drake was on it the first year. It's going to be Spring Hills ball. 33 has checked back into the ball game for Akron. We're going to try it with two. Yep. Make somebody else beat you. Ava's got to drive that in there. Livy's going to have to. Somebody's going to have to make the decision that they're going to. Kenzie pulls the three. Ava Mack with the rebound, and she's going to get a jump ball call. I mean, I don't understand that. Nobody had the ball. Not a soul. Livy with a good wrap around. She just couldn't get it go. She got her on rebound 33 with the foul. Now we just got to make free throws, man. Free throws are huge. She's got the first one. And something else you got to do is you got to rebound. You've got to rebound. Off the front there. You got to limit those shots. Yeah. You can't get three three chances every time to get down the court. And thirty three is she she can get that she can get that other opportunity. So you got to make sure you have a body on her. Ava Mack gambled there. Oh, she missed it. 
And that's one that she probably don't normally miss there. Raven Max out front. Go. She's going to get fouled. Number two is going to get caught. I like, Ava made a good move, but she just got to be stronger there. Like, take that in there. I keep saying I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna I'm gonna count this last well last four and four and a, four and thirty. I'm gonna try to keep count in my head. I, I keep saying I'm gonna bring a four. We're two and two. Well, we're two and two right now in the last four and a half minutes, and that could be big. That could be. I mean, if you can pull it, if you get some stops and pull it close, and free throws it would end up being huge. She just stands there and just reaches over everybody. Twenty knocks it out, which probably was the best thing because I don't think Ava Mack was ready for that one. Thirty-three is going to get called for another one. It's only two on her though. Two of five. Three of six. Fifty percent. We're matched up again. I think that's because because that gives you the best defense on with the big with the with the big girl in there. You just can't, like, Kenzie kind of got lost there. I mean, Kenzie's making her work. 33's working. Kenzie just kind of gets lost there. Ava Max got a cut to the goal. Blake is going to go shoot free throws. So, for the last 317 here, we're going to be shooting two from here on out. Number one has four. Four seven. Can't quit yawning. You got that one. Eight. Spring Hill's going to take a timeout. Oh, I'm going pressing. Yeah. Here's the thing, though, Philip. You got it. It's a 10-point game. You're going to press. You've had, you got what, three, maybe four that you played off the bench? Yeah, I would roll out there with my starters, and we would we would live and die there. We're not in foul trouble. We're not in foul trouble, but how much gas do they have left in the tank? That That's going to be your question. They're going to they have to give you three more minutes. Well. I mean, I, I've always said that if you can't play, you can't play a basketball game at 16, 17, 18 going full out, you need to be in better shape. Well, I, I – I, I understand that too, but there's I mean, that that is the question. Like how much, how much gas do they have left? And Andrea hadn't been back in the ball game, so she may have a little bit fresher legs. Some actors. I like the lineup he's got out there. I do too. Little little size. I'm gonna press here. It's two two one press. About three quarters of a press too. She gets her own rebound. Man, that's just t- that's just so that- tough because that resets your shot clock and everything. So now they got 35 more seconds. So they don't have to be in a hurry.
Ava with the block. Blakely's going to get called for the foul. I do have to say, since that first, since the first game that we had at home, we had some girls getting foul trouble. So far, our girls have done pretty good about staying out of foul trouble. We're gonna have to match up. <laughs> that was a pretty good play design right there. And they got the cut they wanted, the, they just couldn't make the pass. You got to go. Yeah, you, you got to go. You ain't got time, time. To, time to walk it up. You got to go. I don't, I don't understand. I don't understand. I understand setting up a play, maybe. Good pass. Man, you just, it. man, you've had so many of those that you've left. You've left on the on the board tonight. Those and free throws and rebounds, man. That's just what you're going to look at. Ava Matt knocks it away. And they're going to say it's Akron's ball. I don't know. Can we rewind that? Derek should know he was standing right there. He's too professional. I'd have been home. Oh, that, you wrong. I'd be telling him right now, dude, you were wrong. You know it was white ball. You know that's wrong, Carl. You just can't let her catch it catch that's it that it. close. That's it. Got to go. We're just, I mean, you got to have a sense of urgency. Kenzie shoots it. Ava with the rebound. Now Libby's going to shoot it. In and out. Libby's going to get the rebound, and she flips it up. I don't know how she made that one. Green Hill's going to take a timeout. I don't know how she flipped that one up from the backside. You just can't let 33 catch it. Uh, we don't get a steal right now. It's over. Ten points is a lot. Reggie Miller might could do it. What he what he had to do, what he do it in? Like thirteen seconds. Yeah. Kind of he kind of reminded me of the way I played, you know. Just make make ten that's points what, in, in thirteen seconds. That's that's kind of how I used to roll. That's what Mike Calhoun used to call Pacer. Used to call him Reggie. Yeah. UAHT graduates from Spring Hill High School can attend UAHT for free. Their first year with the Hempstead Guarantee Scholarship. Visit uaht.edu slash Hempstead Guarantee to learn more. Caney Creek Estates, a family-friendly community and affordable living. Diamond Bank, the natural choice for community banking. And Yates Maintenance, eating air experts for your home or business. You gotta be. Uh, you're gonna. You're gonna start fouling here. Put them on the free. Well, you got. You got a couple of free fouls before they go to the free throw line. But you had a. And you got. Well, he's got four. You, you've got a gamble. You've got a gamble now. You have to go for the steal. Call that one on Blakely. Blake said, "I don't think that was a foul." I thought that was a jump ball. He's gonna pull 33 and get better ball handler in for for them. She don't she don't she's not a bad ball handler, but I just think 14 may be a little bit better. So now they're gonna go shoot some free throws.
You got that one to go. What was it? Four and seven, Philip, in that in the last stretch on our free throws. Uh, no, we were uh, five and eight. Five and eight. We'll check that. I mean, it's not good. It's not. I mean, yeah. It's and they made both the chairs. You got to try to shoot the ball. So five is fouled out. So Ava's going to go shoot free throws, which is where you want to be. You want to be on the free throw line. But with 39 seconds, it's a pretty pretty good deficit. You have to try to try to climb out in that 39 seconds. But our girls are right there. Our girls have have are starting to figure some stuff out. Ava gets that one to go. Yeah, they've had some close. They've had some close wins, and the two, the two going to win the conference. Probably so, and they've had two losses. That's at home. That was tight losses. I mean, we're right there in the ball game. Thirty second timeout by Aiken. Oh, man, come on, guys. It's eleven point game for thirty six seconds. Left. This is over. Yeah, our girls are right there. It's it's not. Our girls can, can can compete with the conference, in the conference, and we have. Um, I, I was told that they're two and two in conference right now, so I mean they're they're going to be, they they're not going to be the top. They're going to be right there in that second group, and that can make a push and, and get to regionals, and maybe even get to, if they play well enough down the stretch, maybe could make the state tournament. But you're going to have to have to get some stuff figured out, and, and they're and they're getting. Oh, they're playing a lot better than they did the first game. Yeah, they are. And they're, everybody's starting to figure it out. Ava, Ava Purefoy is in a new role this year, that point guard role. It, it's it's a lot different for her. It's a lot different looking. Libby, too. Coach Kaiser is upset about something. I'm not sure what he's upset about. And that's going to be the final two seconds of the ball game. 49-60 is going to be the final score. And the it, it kind of pulled away from it there at the end, Philip. It, it was a lot closer um, than, it, than it had been being, uh, according to the scoreboard. But senior boys coming up next. We'll be with you for the start of that game. EAC that prepares you for good jobs right now, where your instructors teach you the skills you need to be competitive. You want to be prepared to enter the workforce immediately, and you want to stay out of debt. At UAHT, you can. Is your system struggling to keep up? Experience the comfort of Yates Maintenance Heating and Air. It is our mission to provide world-class service and HVAC solutions backed by our certified indoor air quality expertise. Visit YatesMaintenance.com to find out more.
you want an education that's going to take you places. To know that your instructors are going to support you when the work gets hard and cheer you on when you succeed. You want programs that fit with your busy life, challenge you, and put you on the path to the career you've always wanted. And you want to stay out of debt. At UAHT, you can. Is your system struggling to keep up? Experience the comfort of Yates Maintenance Heating and Air. It is our mission to provide world-class service and HVAC solutions backed by our certified indoor air quality expertise. Visit YatesMaintenance.com to find out more. You want an education that's going to take you places. To know that your instructors are going to support you when the work gets hard and cheer you on when you succeed. You want programs that fit with your busy life, challenge you, and put you on the path to the career you've always wanted. And you want to stay out of debt. At UAHT, you can. You don't want your education to be on hold. You want an education in HVAC that prepares you for good jobs right now, where your instructors teach you the skills you need to be competitive. You want to be prepared to enter the workforce immediately, and you want to stay out of debt. At UAHT, you can. Is your system struggling to keep up? Experience the comfort of Yates Maintenance Heating and Air. It is our mission to provide world-class service and HVAC solutions backed by our certified indoor air quality expertise. Visit YatesMaintenance.com to find out more. You want an education that's going to take you places. To know that your instructors are going to support you when the work gets hard and cheer you on when you succeed. You want programs that fit with your busy life, challenge you, and put you on the path to the career you've always wanted. And you want to stay out of debt. At UAHT, you can. Is your system struggling to keep up? Experience the comfort of Yates Maintenance Heating and Air. It is our mission to provide world-class service and HVAC solutions backed by our certified indoor air quality expertise. 
Visit YatesMaintenance.com to find out more. You want an education that's going to take you places. To know that your instructors are going to support you when the work gets hard and cheer you on when you succeed. You want programs that fit with your busy life, challenge you, and put you on the path to the career you've always wanted. And you want to stay out of debt. At UAHT, you can. You don't want your education to be on hold. You want an education in HVAC that prepares you for good jobs right now. Where your instructors teach you the skills you need to be competitive. You want to be prepared to enter the workforce immediately. And you want to stay out of debt. At UAHT, you can. Is your system struggling to keep up? Experience the comfort of Yates Maintenance Heating and Air. It is our mission to provide world-class service and HVAC solutions backed by our certified indoor air quality expertise. Visit YatesMaintenance.com to find out more. You want an education that's going to take you places. To know that your instructors are going to support you when the work gets hard and cheer you on when you succeed. You want programs that fit with your busy life, challenge you. All right, we're back with you. Getting ready for the start of the senior boys game. Looks like uh, no starting lineups tonight, Philip. Maybe it's because Akron is such a ways away. I don't know why we don't play them on Friday night. Yeah, well, it's it's Christmas break. They well, it's they not may have Christmas break. We're supposed to be in school. Tomorrow. I think. Well, for them, they they just have well, finals. Was well, yeah, that's true. A dang bottle of water is two dollars. No, it ain't. No, uh, it's water. Austin's going to jump. Maverick's on the floor. Andrew's on the floor. JP and Levin are going to be your starting five for the Bears. Austin, during the senior girls' halftime, was down here putting on a show, so I'd like to see him get one. Uh, Y'all might hear me holler again. Number two could jump, too. He won that tip. We're going to match up. Which is probably, I mean, it's probably not a bad idea. Yep, 25. with all, Got a push on Austin. And see, didn't the, long. it didn't take long. Austin that Austin was in his, in the rebounding position, had, had the block out going. 1-3-1 one, one from Akern. Andrews has it in the corner. Kicks it all the way across to Mavericks. He steps into a three. He's got a funky release. Maverick? Yeah. The boys have won a couple of couple by some pretty large margins in the last few. Wouldn't mind seeing that trend continue tonight. Their coach ain't happy with that because he didn't pass the ball. 
I was trying to look at our record. Oh. Eight and 11, five and six. So their girls have played a lot more games than the boys have. Austin's going to pull it. No, they haven't. Eight and 11. That's right. That, well, I, I didn't remember what they're 17 and three. and three. Their girls have won a lot more than their boys there. There you go. How about that? I can't, I couldn't have told you what they were wrecking for. I can't remember what I did five minutes ago. Spring Hill with some pretty good defense. Bank was open for that shot. Don't settle for threes. Work the ball around. Don't turn it over right there. Akron's out pushing. Andrew's probably going to get called to that one. I called on JP. Pop space. Austin just got called for one. Or Andrew, excuse me. Rebound. I get the rebound. Levin gets it, and he's out on the break. Andrew's going to get it. How is it a jump ball? He never, the Akron guy never had a hold of it. Man, that's a, that's a tough pass to make. It takes forever for it to come down. Maverick with the pump fake and take, and he's going to score two. Austin with the rebound gets it out to Andrew. Andrew pulls it. It's going to be short. Austin's gonna get a get called for a foul. Come on, let's get in some kind of rhythm. Get in a rhythm. Yep, we need in a rhythm. Maverick knocks it away. Ends up with it. Pulls up from the elbow and gets it to go. I like the pressure. I think we need. I think Spring Hill needs to run a run a press. That had some weird rotation on it. Mav's gonna go to the free throw line. He kind of got bailed out. He got too deep. He got a little deep. He did get bailed out. He was expecting the contact earlier. Gets that one to go. This is second free throw, though. Two blocks back to back there from uh, Austin. I want to say Austin Andrews. That's that's. I don't know why it's getting tripped up tonight. JP's going to come out of there with it. Maverick pump fakes, pulls up. And he gets it to go. He is failing that. He's got all seven right now. Got a rebound. JP needs to be careful. Yeah. 
Number two is going to get called for over the back. JP can't stop right there. That's super dangerous. Shoot it. Maverick does from the corner. Couldn't get it to go. He was just waiting. He was waiting to call that when he was staring right at him. Blaine Tuttle's at the right. score table going to check in for Austin. Andrew should have shot in the corner. I understand trying to get it to the hot hand, but man, when you're wide open. Yeah. When he's got his feet set, like you said, he, he becomes a, a really, really, really good shooter. He's a good shooter off the bounce, but he's a better shooter when he's got his feet set. Blaine with the block. You just kind of have to get physical with two. He, wa he wants to be physical. You had to get physical, too. Maverick takes it in. He's going to get fouled. It seems like they call. It's like the girls' game gets too physical. And then they go in to meet with the officials or whatever and, and they're talking so we got to tighten up a little bit yeah and then they don't let the boys game have the physicality the that the girls game does i don't know both starting big men for both teams got two fouls I, early and i hate i hate a game with a bunch of fouls man can't get that one to go Go step back. JP with a rebound. He's got he's got let he had Levin out. JP lost the lost the handle on that one. He's gotta stop the ball. Can't let him just get to get get to the rim like that. One thirty. We still ain't in a rhythm offensively, Philip. Got to, got to try to find something. That's that drive and kick out. That's what JP JP's got to get some of that going down here because that's that's one thing that we've done done really good with. Blaine's going to go in. He's going to miss that one. Blaine with the rebound. Gets it out to Andrew. He gets it up to Levin. Levin had a lane, I thought. Maverick drives in and gets it to go. Can be oh three got it to go. It looks short. Eleven got to go up with that. Gonna wait for the last shot here. Eleven catch it, go right up with it. That's what I wanted him to do the first time. Short. Tied up here at the end of the first. No. No. Rhythm. No. Nothing. I mean, that was just a blah first quarter. Yeah. Because we've seen them. We've seen them when they come out in a rhythm, and and, and just not just don't have much of a rhythm right now. And all. Mm, excuse me. On offense. Uh, you got starts down here on the side, on the defensive side. Playing flat-footed. Pafford Medical Services, let us take care of everything. Brazil Ocrest Funeral, the funeral home, we care. 
Heather Manor Nursing and Rehabilitation, providing your loved ones with the care they deserve. ESE Spray Services, pesticide, herbicide, and aquatic applications for residential and commercial. I know, I know the them guys. They they've done some work for us at work, and and they do a pretty good job. It's going to be the same five on the floor. For the Bears, excuse me, can't quit yawning for some reason. Andrew's going to be on the ball. Levin has switched to two. Good rotation. Good switch back. Somebody's going to have to stop three. three. Three's working us over right now. Levin catch and shoot. Hits the pipe, so it's going to be Agern's ball. Watch the penetration and watch number three. Maverick's going to have to get get physical with him. Three in the lane. Yeah. That's the first time that's been called all night. And I'm sure it's because coaches was in their their officials' ears making sure he knew that was going on. Maverick dumps it to Blaine. Blaine can't get that one to go, but he's in there fighting for the rebound. Don't end up with it, though. Good help side from Levin right there. JP drives, kicks it out. Blaine's going to throw, lay that one in. It's a good pass from Levin. Are we in a zone now? Yes. Or are we just we just mashed up like it's a zone. Number eleven hits the three. I think we're just matched up like it was a zone. Eleven with a good pass from from Andrew. Them two's been playing together for a long time. They just kind of know how each other plays. Yeah, we're man. Andrew slips under and knocks that one away, but it's going to stay with Akron. You just can't let somebody shoot that from the free throw line. That's just too easy. Andrew over here on the wing. He catch and shoot. Little long eleven catches it, fires it into Maverick, and he's going to get the two. Kicks out. Good closeout by Maverick. JP flips it out to Maverick. And that's a tough shot to get it to go. Maverick does end up... Excuse me, he does end up getting that one go. Good help from JP right there. Blaine's going to get called for the foul. That hit the shot clock. Number three has a weird rotation on this ball field when he lets it go. Andrew catch, drives, kicks it to Blaine. Oh, I just can't get it to go. Blaine's going to get called for over the back. 
Dang. We didn't get the coughing up here. You still got that water? <clears throat> Andrew knocks it away out of bounds, though. Austin's going to check in for Blaine. They both got two fouls each. Just Austin's got to play smart. I know he likes to jump with them, but keep your feet on the ground. Like that right there, and that's okay. That's that's just a good that's good offense too. I mean, there ain't a whole lot more he could have done because he's got to be smart. Can't just body him up. Eleven catch and shoot, a little strong. One, one shot possession, killer. One are killing and, and maybe one one pass. Blaine's coming back in now. Andrew on the wing, thought about it for a second, skip past to Levin, gets it to Maverick. Maverick dumps it down to Blaine for the easy two. Maverick with the extra pass right there, that's what you'd like to see. Yeah, that was a good pass. Close out. That one got a yeah, close, close out. out. You can't get too far away from three. He's, he's, he's one of the best players they got. He's got quite a few of their points. Levin's going to get called for a cheap one right there. Carried it. You don't see that called too much. Every once in a while they'll call that one. That was a tough pass. Yeah, Blaine ended up with it, and then he's going to get fouled. I mean, that was just a yeah, – he had a lot of English on it. It was down at his feet. Mm -hmm. it's, it's hard to handle down there. Andrew, and he's going to get fouled after the shot. So it's going to be Spring Hill's ball on the sideline. Jet's going to check in. Jacob's going to check in. They're going to say it's on the, on the sideline. May not be Megan. Andrew pulls that one. Just can't just can't get nothing to go right now. Levin stepped in front of the pass, and Levin gets it to go. Maybe that'll get his jump started here. They've got to play defense. Everything, our, our offense has never been... Great, unless we're playing good defense. When you play good defense, the offensive side just gets so much easier. It does. I like Jacob running the, the, the soft spot to soft spot.
Jet pulls the three. They get it to go. As many threes as he shot in his life, he should be able to do that. Yep. He was trying to shoot him in sixth grade. We'd always get mad at him. We did. Him and Clay both. Ball's, ball's out. It's going to be spring. Hmm. Excuse me, it's going to be spring hill. That inside out pass is Jacob flips it back out. Jet. Andrew pulls the three. A little bit strong. Andrew just can't get one to go right now from deep. Three seconds in the lane. Blaine's got to get out of there. Excuse me. When they get to calling it, he's going to call it on the other end too, so you got to be aware of it if you're in there. Akern's holding it for the last shot here. That's a tough shot. Blaine ends up with it. 26-28 is going to be the score going into halftime, and we'll be back with you for the start of the third quarter. and put you on the path to the career you've always wanted. And you want to stay out of debt. At UAHT, you can. Is your system struggling to keep up? Experience the comfort of Yates Maintenance Heating and Air. It is our mission to provide world-class service and HVAC solutions backed by our certified indoor air quality expertise. Visit YatesMaintenance.com to find out more. You want an education that's going to take you places. To know that your instructors are going to support you when the work gets hard and cheer you on when you succeed. You want programs that fit with your busy life, challenge you, and put you on the path to the career you've always wanted. And you want to stay out of debt. At UAHT, you can. You don't want your education to be on hold. You want an education in HVAC that prepares you for good jobs right now, where your instructors teach you the skills you need to be competitive. You want to be prepared to enter the workforce immediately, and you want to stay out of debt. At UAHT, you can.
Is your system struggling to keep up? Experience the comfort of Yates Maintenance Heating and Air. It is our mission to provide world-class service and HVAC solutions backed by our certified indoor air quality expertise. Visit YatesMaintenance.com to find out more. You want an education that's going to take you places. To know that your instructors are going to support you when the work gets hard and cheer you on when you succeed. You want programs that fit with your busy life, challenge you, and put you on the path to the career you've always wanted. And you want to stay out of debt. At UAHT, you can. Is your system struggling to keep up? Experience the comfort of Yates Maintenance Heating and Air. It is our mission to provide world-class service and HVAC solutions backed by our certified indoor air quality expertise. Visit YatesMaintenance.com to find out more. You want an education that's going to take you places. To know that your instructors are going to support you when the work gets hard and cheer you on when you succeed. You want programs that fit with your busy life, challenge you, and put you on the path to the career you've always wanted. And you want to stay out of debt. At UAHT, you can. You don't want your education to be on hold. You want an education in HVAC that prepares you for good jobs right now, where your instructors teach you the skills you need to be competitive. You want to be prepared to enter the workforce immediately, and you want to stay out of debt. At UAHT, you can. Is your system struggling to keep up? Experience the comfort of Yates Maintenance Heating and Air. It is our mission to provide world-class service and HVAC solutions backed by our certified indoor air quality expertise.
All right, JP just shot that one from the corner, and he was a little bit long on it. That was the, that's really the only thing that's happened. We was a little slow getting back to you, um, but we got to we got to find some rhythm. Um, Philip, I was told that Jacob is, has not has been a little under the weather, so that's part of the reason why he's probably not getting as much as much playing time right now because he just oh, Andrew just took that one away from him. And he's going to get fouled. Oh, called a walk. Called a walk. We're in the one three one now, which I, I I like seeing it switch it up a little bit. They're going to get travel. Get called for the travel. Blaine got the got the start of the third quarter because um, Austin in foul trouble. Yep, that's a little long. It was in line, but it was a little long. JP's got to turn around, and stop the ball. Andrew from the corner. They're just letting to shoot it. Yeah. I like him. I like him not settling for the for that three again and, and taking a little floater there. Got to get some stops here. going to be a charge. Blaine at top key, dumps it to Maverick, gets it to go. Andrew got to be careful. Not to pick up a cheap one there. Levin's closeout was just, a, I, I mean, he was kind of in line with us. It was, it seemed like he was a little off to the side from him. You got to get your, cl- you got to get your hand up in his face. Maverick down there low, kicks it back out to JP. He's going to pull it a little bit long. Andrew with the rebound. Gets it out to Levin. Levin kicks it back to Andrew. Cross court to JP. He drives, kicks it to Blaine. That's the free throw line. Three seconds in the lane on Maverick. If you start hearing a, a, you hear that wind off of the, off my fan. So if you're at home and you hear something that sounds a little different, it's because I got my fan going. And I got hot up here. Got quiet. They did get quiet. Maverick's gonna tip it. Stay with it. They're just letting us shoot that that shot. We've had, we've shot, oh, Levin's going to strip it and gets the easy two. They're just gonna, they're letting us shoot it because we can't hit a three right now. I don't know if we've even made one. Well, I know Jet made the one. Yeah, that's it. And I'm not saying don't take it if it ain't open, but I mean, you got to make a move. Got to make them work.
Blaine's got to turn and go up strong there. May want to know where he's at. He's hit two in a row. Red stretch to nine. We've matched up now. Maverick with the rebound. It's jump ball. Austin's going to check in. Got a rebound, too. We just look look a little lethargic right now. Maverick gets it to go. Take the ball to the take the ball to the goal. Let's pen, let's penetrate and, and kick it out. We gotta get gotta get going to the goal. That's what I holler at my second graders is go to the basket. Here's the deal. If you can't make a three, you gotta drive. Three seconds in the line. I mean, you got to find a hole in the defense. Yeah, you got to find it. Settle down in it. Get in the soft spot on the on the baseline. I mean, there's there, there's some spots that you can get. There at the high post is just wide open. Andrew finally gets one to go through. Maybe that'll loosen it up a little bit. Austin comes out there with it. That's a charge. I don't really think it was. Well, when he spins and he, (laughs) excuse me, when he spins and kind of leans into it, number, number four has two. You know where I'd be going? At number two. He's in that corner over there. Levin's going to pull it from the kick out. Stop. We got a, a – um, Austin was the only one down there close to the goal to rebound that, too. JP almost had that one. Got 11 seconds here. 11 points. We're here shows 12 for 20. 27 shoot threes. Let's uh, let's try something different, please. Got to drive. JP got five seconds. Kicks it to 11. 11 gets a good look. Oh. PSE Spray Services, pesticide, herbicide, and aquatic applications for residential and commercial. I think I said that one last time. Farmers Bank and Trust, easy banking for busy living. Visit myfarmers.bank. Randy's Collision Center. A collision is stressful, but the collision repair process doesn't have to be. Bring your car to Randy's Collision Center, and we'll, we'll get you back on the road in no time. 
Advantage Self Storage, a family-owned and operated company dedicated to both serving, dedicated to serving both residential and commercial storage needs. Mm-hmm. You're gonna have to stay leaned up like that. Just so you can feel the air. No, so I don't have to hear that. Oh. If I lean back, I'll turn. I'll turn my fan off of me. You don't like it? No, that's very annoying. What about there? Can you hear it? Yep. Just keep my head, keep yep, my head tilted hear. down. I'm good now. But I like my fan. Uh, I get hot up here, Philip. We both got shorts on. Told Mr. Steve, uh, Mr. Smeed, while ago, I was like, I'm hot up there. Them the headphones make my ears hot. Probably because people talk, you know, everybody say your ears will get hot. It's because people talking about you. Spring Hills ball. JP drives, kicks it out. That's what I want to see. Drive, kick it out if it's not there. Andrew drives, kicks it to Austin. He gets it up. So they're going to say one of them wants to call a foul, one of them trying to call a walk. If anything, it's a jump ball or a walk because that's what they've been. They've been calling that one-handed jump ball all night. They're going to call it a walk, so it's going to be Spring Hill's ball. Give me a break. He's got him sealed off trying trying to, I mean, that's four going to ride with him. Man, I don't know how it's a foul. I, I'm not sure how it's a foul either. He has the right to position just as much. That's, well, maybe it's a test word. JP's going to bring it up the floor. Austin gets fouled. I'm going to go shoot some free throws. They need him in there so he can do that right there. We ain't seen Carson tonight either. Huh? We ain't seen Carson tonight either. We haven't seen Carson tonight. Does it look a little bit thin over there to you? Levin is going to end up with it, and he's going to get fouled. Extra effort from Levin right there. Levin's going to get called for one there. I wish we quit shoot threes. Yep. We got it. We got to drive. We've got to drive the ball. Maverick tips it. JP gets it. JP's going to lay it in. It all started from Maverick's tip pass. Maverick's going to get called for one. Got to move his feet. I know. I know he's trying to. He's trying to kind of catch him, kind of fall in like. Can't let him get free. Drive and kick it. Drive and kick it. Maverick gets it to go. That's back court. You got the chance right here, Phillip. It's tied up. If somebody don't pick JP up, I'd like to see him get on into the get on into the, to the free throw line. Go, 
Levin with the rebound. Flips it up. No good. JP strips it. Who, oh, it's going to stay Spring Hill. Andrew from the corner. Who gets it to go? Oh, that would look like a double dribble. He's done now. This is the first one. Got to be on the offense, Van Phillip. Got to, got to drive. Got to, got to kick it. Try to get in the lane. There you go. That three, I don't mind as much. Blaine's fighting for it. JP comes out there with it. He shoots for three. Levin's fighting for it. Going to be over the back on Levin. I don't think that's over the back either. I mean, there wasn't no blocking out. So that's five fouls on Spring Hill. So for the last 5.15, Akron's going to be shooting free throws. And he got both of those. Andrew's going to push it up the floor. Levin's going to have it. Got to get out of the lane if you're Levin. Hmm. Tough pass. Going to be a turnover. He's calling a jump ball. <clears throat> Jacob's going to check in. It was a jump. Maverick's got to stay a little closer to three. You can't let him get a good look. Can't allow second second chance points either right now. You got to you got to limit it. That's a tough shot. TJ's at the score table, so he's going to check in. Oh, yeah, we're not, he, he don't want to get out rebounded. <clears throat> uh, it's... 
Like I said, there's been not much flow. Not not much We've flow. We've got a lot of quick threes that we could get late in the shot clock. Yeah. I mean, it's just. Yeah, the, the flow hasn't quite been there. Hadn't been quite there. <laughs> And when it, when you're when the fouls are coming like they're coming, it's it's it really is hard to get in a rhythm. Because yep. there's uh, you know, Austin picks up one here, and then Levin picked up a couple quick. Like it, it's just like it's it's really hard to to get in the flow whenever the game keeps stopping. And that's that's why coaches call timeout when the other teams get in the flow because it, it 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 stops your rhythm. Good teams can can go through that. <clears throat> Gonna have to get some stops on defense. Andrew's going to pull it. It's going to be Akron's ball. You can tell Jacob just don't have a lot of energy from 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 being a little under the weather. Eight on the shot clock now. Shot clock don't reset, though, does it? So they only got two seconds. <clears throat> Not sure how that happens with two seconds left. That's what JP needs to be doing the whole time. <laughs> Wiley's Glass and Salvage, your premier source for all your auto parts and glass needs. If we don't got it, we can get it. Unity Baptist Church, we have a place for you. Big Mac's Barbecue. Stop by and try our daily lunch specials and our mouth-watering barbecue. Oh. <laughs> been a tough one tonight. You'll come out of here 218 left on the on the clock. Still well within reach, but you're going to have to you're going to have to make some stops some on stops. defense. Some rebounding. Make some shots. Yeah. We we've, we've struggled tonight. Twenty-two is kind of out of control there. Eleven's going to get called for the foul. That's his fourth one. I don't know who said that. that was not a very good uh, insult. I mean, I'm, the fans I'm, aren't happy right now. I'm a trash talking extraordinaire. That was it. Was too long. It's too, too long. long. He doesn't know what he's doing. Point. That's why he's not blowing the whistle. But he's short and to the point. <laughs> Jacob Beth, comes in. Uh, yeah, uh, yeah. Short and to the point. You got to go though. You got to attack. You don't have. You you get. You're gonna get possessions, but you got to attack. The you got to attack here. You just can't get nothing to go.
I mean, Jagger even looks a little bad. Yeah, he, he does. You can just tell. He stood in there and took that charge, though. And, you know, I mean, you know, not having him at full strength because he's been coming off the – he's been either starting or coming – being one of the first ones come off the off the bench. And, you know, that's uh, – uh-uh. you know, that, that hurts that hurts you. Austin being in foul trouble hurts you. It hurts you, it hurts you a lot. He's – you got him and Blaine and, you know, losing Griffin – uh, that I mean, he was also he was gonna play your four this year. I mean that that hurts your side. That hurts your sides. I mean it's 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 tough. It's just something that you have to deal with. It's this is not not something that was planned. But like you said, Austin being in foul trouble, that just he he couldn't get in a rhythm. He couldn't, you know, you know, because he's well. The last home game that we that we watched here. Um, he had lots of touches around the rim. Well, he had I mean, a he, touch going. And, he's a great rebounder, a good shot and spur, and and when he gets the ball around the basket, he normally scores. He just know? and he's done pretty good about staying out of foul trouble for the most part of this year, but he's got to learn when to jump and when not to jump, and it's hard. He cause, reminds cause me he so much of Colin. He, he does because they they have that ability to jump. Colin sitting down there in in his. Throwback Henderson hat, or his golf hat, but he, it's like you said, it's the same thing. Just the the jumping, knowing that you can block it, don't mean you have to try to block it every time. You got to get some points going here. You got to go. JP drives, kicks it out. Maverick drives, kicks it out. Oh man, it's just it's like a lid's been on this basket down here for us tonight. <laughs> oh man. He's not missed many from the line tonight. Uh, he's uh, probably their best crew shooter. <clears throat> Got both of those. Stretch it to nine. Maverick gets one to go. Spring Hill's going to take a timeout. Someone who bleached the shirt. UAHT. Graduates from Spring Hill High School can attend UAHT for free their first year with the Hempstead Guarantee Scholarship. Visit uaht.edu slash Hempstead Guarantee to learn more. Caney Creek Estates. A family-friendly community and affordable living. Diamond Bank. The natural choice for community banking. Yates Maintenance. Heat and air experts for your home or business. We appreciate all of our sponsors. We appreciate y'all for watching. Um, make sure you're following uh, Swark Dot Today on Facebook. Make sure you're following the YouTube channel. Um, that way, people can can watch these kids play. People that are sick uh, here's don't the, feel uh, good coming out of the coming out of the timeout. We're going, if, if you don't get the steal. You got a foul. I mean, I, my deal is, I would try to gamble until I got a pass half court. Once I get a pass half court, you got a foul. Yep. Jacob almost had it. What? Had it traveled. Both groups are doing a little seven. TJ's gonna and Levin's gonna do a little offense and defense. JP needs to keep going. Maverick turns it over there, dribbled it off of his foot. Twenty two missed it, but they got the rebound. Thirty seconds now. 
Man. Don't that's, foul. That's what I've been trying to get. We've been wanting to get them in there all night, and JP just couldn't get that one to go, man. It's just been a tough night for the Bears. What's the next game? Uh, let me look. Got a schedule here somewhere. I want to thank Brian for texting me. She needs to do that every time. To what? To tell me when there's a game. Oh, yeah. She does. She texts us. She's like, hey, there's a game. We'll have January the 4th, and we got Fordyce at home, and January the 9th, we have Derek's at home. So... They'll, this is the last game until after Christmas, and they'll have the Washita Christmas Classic that they'll be the, the senior girls and senior boys will be playing in for the 28th through the 30th, and then we'll be back at home January the 4th and the 9th. Fordyce isn't conference no more, but Derrick's is. So. Dorks. I don't like Derrick's. Oh, they've always been our rivals ever since uh, – well, it really started with Caleb and them's group. It's kind of when the a couple years after I graduated was when the when the rivalry with Derrick's really kicked off. Big football school. Gonna be trying to get it, get a get a three here. Andrew pulls it, gets it to go. Ten seconds left. Not if you're not gonna talk. You get embarrassed. We do we do appreciate all of our sponsors and we do appreciate everybody tuning in. It's just been it's been a tough go in the fourth quarter. Well, the whole game's just been a tough go. Huh? What do you think? Yeah. Yeah. It's been a, it's been a, it's just, I mean they just couldn't get in, and even some of the easy baskets. Even some of the easy baskets. They just could, we just couldn't get to go. All right, Maverick's going to be on the ball. They pitch it deep. TJ's going to get called for the foul there. <laughs> Andrew pulls another one. JP. Don't get it off in time. January the 4th, we'll be back home with you. And the 9th, we'll be back with you then. Take your win. Visit YatesMaintenance.com to find out more. You want an education that's going to take you places. To know that your instructors are going to support you when the work gets hard and cheer you on when you succeed. 